Plague Tale Requiem. Uh, I'm going to give a quick PSA just in case because I do know that some people do not like rats. There are a lot of rats in this game. So if you do not like mice or rats or rodents, um, this may not be the best game for you to watch. So just a quick heads up. As you can see, there are many tiny mice down below me. This game features rat mechanics. <laughs> literal rap mechanics um so yeah we're gonna go ahead and check this game out i'm actually gonna play this game with controller because i played the first one uh with controller i'm also gonna check these settings uh yeah i agree uh continue i'm gonna do that uh-huh and settings okay let me just check out settings um we ain't no punk ass bitch, so we are going to go ahead and um, we're going to play this on the hardest difficulty. Uh, disables adjusted time lapses before helps appear. Vibration. Steady camera. Reduces camera movement and shaking. Yes, please. Disables animated backgrounds behind menus. No, I want that. I love that, actually. Uh, the tutorial. Yes. Objectives. Yes. Standard HUD. Uh-huh, 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 Enemy status indicator? Oh, I won't see how much health enemies have. Okay, well. I think that's happening. Uh, uh, I always like to check the settings. Uh, English. English. Subtitles, yes. English. Character names, yes. Character name colors, yes. Medium, good. Background, yes. Um, yep. Yep. Okay. Uh, graphics. Uh, we'll see how the graphics look. Looks like everything's set to high already. Listening mode. Beauty audio. Uh, all right. I think that's it. I think that's all we're going to need. So, um, without further ado, let's go ahead and jump on into this. Because I honestly forget. Um, hi fi allows for sound. Oh, wait, yeah, no. Uh, headphones. God, I don't. I don't even know why I didn't do that. Uh, voice English, English. Yes, subtitles English. Uh, oh yeah, we already did this. Okay. Uh, confirm. Ah, this background's like really, really pretty. I like this. Yeah. Fuck you, rats. All right. Chapter one, under a new sun. Luckily, I won't have to read for this game because there's voice acting in this game. Hopefully, they, I hope they do a recap. I hope I love when a game like series does like a recap. That way I don't have to explain and you guys, gals and pals can just watch and I can also just watch because I, I kind of remember what happened in the first one. So a long screen. Okay. Kingdom of France. June 1349. Gonna go find some uh, lurk and find some food. Sounds good, Leo. Take care. For me. Come on, sorcerer, catch us! Hey, slow down. You'll exhaust our villain. This is your tower. It's evil. Doesn't he ever get tired? I really should get back to studying. Come on, we had a long journey today. Please, Mother said to try to exhaust him. Right, that was the plot of the first one. They were trying to find their mother. Your fight is far from over. Your mother's going to wonder where we are. Okay. It's a long road. You have the right to stretch your legs. <sighs> yes. Right. So this is, um, I think her name is Amisha, and that is her younger brother, Hugo. Um, and in the first game, their, uh, their home got destroyed. 
by an invading army, I think. And the whole entire journey was them trying to run away and find their family and everything. Um, I forget who you are, guy. I forget who you are. It's been a while. It's been a while since I played the first one. Really long time. Uh, your mother is going to die of an infection. Uh, no, you. Also, hi, Slit. How are you doing? Look at that. A castle. Let's go see. This is honestly really, really pretty. Time to run. Oh, Hugo, sprint. You're gonna sweat like a hog. I am sweating Thank like you. A hog. Enjoy. <laughs> it's good for you. Running is not good. For, actually, it is. Cardio is very, very good for you. Uh, uh, existing. Sounds like you might have had a Monday Monday. Like Thank you for the picture, home. by the way, demo. <laughs> All right. Uh, hold on a second. I noticed some, like, weirdness in the graphics. Let me just go ahead. Oh, yeah. The sync off. That could be the reason why. Uh, full screen. Uh, uh, let's turn this on for balance. Uh, system latency, which increases enable and boost motion blur off. Uh, hi, 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 contact shadows. Uh, we could probably turn everything on high. There we go. Done. Oh, that immediately looks a lot better. Holy shit. turn you into a beetle oh no not beetles i hate beetles we have to hide <laughs> yes i'll count to ten then i'll come for you king hugo and amicia the amazon amicia the amazon go now come amicia the amazon One, we have two, to find a good hiding place three. good let's keep an eye on him now Five, yes oh, we'll move if he comes seven, I'm coming. Oh no, he's coming, he's coming. I smell fear. I Lucas He's being so loud, we can just know where he is. Uh but uh hopefully we can oh Masters of stealth. Masters of stealth. Oh, you got it. You got that, Sleazy. Catch that double knife Pokemon. Approach him stealthily and hit X to scare him. Okay. You just got to get up behind him and then just give him a little spoop. Imagine playing hide and seek and then you just scare the person who's seeking. Fair enough. Well, I'll get back to studying now. Lucas. Well, if I want to become an alchemist. But you are an alchemist. I'm still your mother's apprentice. Right. All right. Go and study. We'll stay a little longer. Right. Goodbye. Come. Let's see the rest of the castle. As you wish, good king. All right. Uh, reach the castle. Me too. We wouldn't be here if not for him. Uh, this game, they did really, really good. Not that the first game didn't have, like, good graphics, but, uh, this one, definitely a big improvement from the last one. Oh, like, already the controls feel good, and the game looks really, really pretty. Uh, but I remember the first one having a really good story. Of course. Just don't fall. Also... Holding yes, Hugo's hand so is actually a mechanic in the game. Great wall. What can you see from up there? My kingdom. Is it prosperous? It was, but then Lucas attacked. Oh yes, the infamous sorcerer. Oh, a river! It's the sea. Let's patrol there. God, this kid is so adorable. This kid is too, too freaking adorable. But uh, hope you're doing well, Slit. Hopefully, the rest of your day is going well, bud. Oh, this is so fucking pretty. This is where my kingdom stops. That 
ranch is your frontier. Yes. <laughs> Why not? Look out, Demisia, the Amazon! Enemy ships coming! They're going to attack us! Oh no! What do we do? Oh, pine cones! Oh, shit. Oh, fine, fine, fine. My mighty sling is yours. Oh, right. Sling time. Yeah, that was her weapon in the first one. She had a sling that she would use. And she would have, like, different things that she could, like, throw. Target practice. To invade us. But we push them back because we are the house of Darun. Ah. Oh, hello. Oh, kid. Hello. Also, hello, hello, Sleepy. How are you doing? Welcome on in. It can be pretty loud, yes. I wanted to ask you. Can I play with you? Yes, but slingshot you, kid. Who are you? I'm Tona. I live nearby. All right. We're Hugo and Amicia. Can you shoot, Tuna? Of course I can. Great. Does he also have powerful sling? Sling action. I'll fire the cannon then. Now let's fight. Wow. Boom. Yeah, she's she's like a really really good crack shot with the uh, the sling. But that was like a big a big mechanic in the first one, using the sling to like. To activate stuff and to stun enemies and stuff because you're just kids and you really can't fight big, big men with swords. There was a lot of them in the first one, I remember. Uh, how are you? I'm doing good. I'm doing really, really good. Um, we have had a pretty awesome stream. We announced the re-releasing -re of the merch shop. Uh, we're moving the merch shop, the Beard Zone merch shop over. Um, and then, um, yeah, we're just, we're just chilling. We're trying this game out. This is a uh, Plague Tale Requiem. Uh, it's the new right, game, right, the course. sequel to Plague Tale Innocence. Surrender accepted. Uh, uh, I should go now. I'm late for work. You work? Yes, on my father's farm with my brothers. Are you all right? Uh, I must go. Bye. Good luck, mm, something fishy about that. Kid be lying about work. You don't punch it in for a nine to five. Come along, my king. The war is over. Let's keep following this river. Something, something be funky there. Something be funky there. But how are you doing, Sleepy? How's everything going with you? Nice. He was. Yes. I'd like to have a friend like him. I know. But we'll settle down soon, and you'll make friends. You're sure? As soon as we know how you're doing. Hmm. That could be a long time. Oh, right. He was also sick. Hugo was sick in the, um, in the first game. If I'm not mistaken. have to climb this. You pull me up this time. What? Just kidding. I'll help you. You're too heavy anyway. How dare you? Wow, Hugo, you be rude. You never do that. That's just rude. That's just rude. I'm all right, just vibing, really. Gotcha, gotcha. Uh, Sleepy, are you going to be around? Uh, actually, Sleepy and Slit, the two of you are going to be around for this Friday for some Overwatch on stream. Uh, I heard the DLC for this game didn't have a lot of substance or a strong direction. I think it was called A Vague Tale. I mean, see, I would think the opposite. That sounds like a lot, a lot of content. From what I understand from those words in that title, that sounds like a lot, a lot of content and juicy story elements. We're charging the castle charge. Ah. Okay, the kid's having an asthma attack. Kid, 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 Hugo, please. The gate is closed, Captain. What do we do? Let me see. Huh? It's locked up tight. They saw us coming. Here, secret path. Let's sneak in. Yes. It's yeah, this plan. this always goes well. This Ooh. always goes really, really well, oh, sneaking into an abandoned castle. Sure, dark. sounds so oh, enthusiastic. And yep, I'll be around. All right, good, good. I was uh, yes. I was gonna send out a message, uh, probably tomorrow, but that's good because I know Freckle's gonna be joining. Don't worry. I'm not and I think I know who else is joining us. So we'll have a nice little five stack, which will be good. Really? 
Oh shit, fuck. Okay. Uh that scared me. Are you hurt? No. Jesus Christ. I agree. That's enough for today. That scared the fuck out of me. There are food and clothes. People live here. We've broken their ceiling. Maybe they heard. Let's just be careful for now. You smell that. It smells like a fireplace. Yes. Okay, well. Hopefully nobody gets mad that we just busted in their castle roof. What? It's all burned. It's recent. These baskets and their beehives. But why are they burned? I don't know. Let's be discreet and get out. Yeah, I don't like this. I don't like this at all. Could it potentially be a plague of sorts? A plague of the bees? It was an accident. Where are the people? Yeah, that's what I'm worried about. The fact that there's no people around and just a bunch of burnt beehives. This way. Ah, the graphics are actually really, really good for this. I like this. Oh, dead bodies. Monsieur. Hey! What, what's going on? How many of you are there? Wait! We didn't mean to trespass. We fell here by accident. We'll leave if you show us how. Lies. I swear. I don't Beekeeper know man. Here, but oh. Nothing to do with it. Lies. You bloody things. I'll cut you to pieces. Run. Come back here. We need an exit. The door. No. 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 Come. Here. All right. Run. Run. Uh, I don't want to fight Bee Man. Keep an eye out for an exit. Oh. Uh, get down quick. Come on, come back, I swear. Get it. Ah, uh, stop. Leave it to me. No. Okay. Goodness, That's how we make sure they don't come back. I lost two. A boy and a girl. You didn't see them. Uh, no, no, that man on the ground's the last we got. Well, kill them if you find them. We must get out of here. Yes, Craig. They're crazy. Yeah, uh, I don't think I'm digging the beekeeping mercenaries. You're dead. Matthias, come. They got Grandad pretty bad. Looks bad. Don't be back from the market any time now. Yes. What a good idea. They find us. We have to keep going. God, okay. I just turn that whining. There may still be some of them around. Go help the others. I don't feel well, Matthias. I don't give a damn. It's you won't move. Whatever. Okay. It'll make a noise. It's the last time they'll come here. Hand throw. To be stealthier, you can throw projectiles by hand. Okay. I don't remember if that. I mean, I know it was a lot of. Uh... Okay, there we go. Hello, Ryan. How are you doing? Is someone still hiding? Yep. We get back Nothing. to the cart. We get away from this place. Mummy will be so angry. We just won't tell her. We'll leave as soon as we get to the cart. Yeah, I would. I would just fucking get the hell out of here. You're supposed to stand guard. This is all on you. We're going to have to climb up quietly. Donna, get your damned ass over here right now. The life out of you. Do I just. Oh shit. Yeah, the kid, the kid lives here. Oh God, my first Pokemon's caught. Heck yeah, way to go, Ryan. Congratulations, dude. Gonna... Come along, up on my way. Yeah, no, the poor kid that we met in the beginning it lives here. That's not good. Let's try through here. I'm 
hearing bees. At least they didn't damage these ones. Wait. Uh oh. So I think the bee men were living here. Okay, so we can do quick reacts. Yeah, congrats, Ryan. How are, how are you doing, by the way, Ryan? Welcome on in. Welcome to Babysitting Rat Simulator. Also, you can type in exclamation point Pokedex to check and see how many Pokemon you've caught and other people's stats and stuff. We have like a, uh, a site that you can check all that stuff. Uh, and hello, Saps. How you doing? Saps, did you finally get home yet? She's a wolf and mouse clothing. Ah! Thank you. Thank you for that, Saps. I was waiting for that. Ah! Uh, hold RB to open the selection menu. If I throw it behind him. Uh, throw to deposit surface. Enemies highlighted white will hear. Oh, right, right. I remember this. Oh, that's cool. It shows you like an indicator on who's actually going to get distracted. That's cool. Yeah, well, I got pots. So take that. Ah. We got the power of rocks, God, and pots. Oh, dead bird. Nice. It's a big old dead bird. Uh, oh, right. All right. Okay, okay, I can tell, I can tell Hugo to go and climb under there. Cool. Um, yep, that's the Pokedex links, and, uh, I am home. Also, shave the rest of my hair off, because it just hurt having it. I got you, but hey, listen, bald is beautiful. Bald is beautiful, Saps. But I, I totally get that and understand why. You would just want to just, like, you know, just go ahead and get it, get it done and everything. But, uh, listen, bald is beautiful. Think about how much you can accessorize now. If you wanted to get a wig, you could get a wig and change the color and, and hair and, like, everything. I, I honestly have thought about getting wigs, being bald man myself. Uh, I'm good. Work was interesting because nothing worked for me, but all good. Oh, was it, like, one of those days that everything was just broken? <gasps> Look, it's an ass. Don't you make that noise at me. That's just weird. Don't make that noise at me. Wigs are fun without hair. Yeah, exactly. Think about it. You don't need to wear a bald cap or anything like that. You just throw the wig on. You just throw it on and you could like, you know, one day have like wig with long hair and then the next day be bald. And then the next day have wig with short spiky hair and then, you know, just mix it up and accessorize. It's honestly, I could have a full head of hair if I just wore wigs. <laughs> All right. Um. That gate over there, let's try it. Oh, wait, is this a choice I get to make? Yeah, I'm not going in the castle, fuck that. Biggest mistake, but I will fix it. Holy shit. Shugo, stay behind me. Who are you? We got lost. We're leaving. Just let the boy go. You hear that, Remy? Are you with the thieves? No, we just arrived. Listen, it's our fault if he was late. You have no right to be here. Remy, you handle it. And don't disappoint me. But the boy, he's the right age to learn. Uh oh. He shouldn't have come. You don't want to do this, believe me. You talk too much. Yeah, no, she is a fighter. Oh shit. Uh huh. Oh fuck. Why? Kick him in the nuts. Oh, knife. Knife him, knife him, knife him. Oh, 
right. I I forgot. Uh, the kid actually has power. Um, I forgot about that. That was the thing in the first game we learned towards the end-ish of the game. <laughs> Uh, wigs are fun without hair. Now I need a redeem wig option. Listen, Anarchy, I actually have one. I have one that just sits there because uh, Story gave me a bunch of wigs. Well, she was throwing out a bunch of wigs, like clearing out some wigs. And I was like, well, now I'm bald. I can use these wigs, but I fucked them up and need to fix them all um, because they're all like mangled and shit. So I do plan on possibly bringing it back as a redeem option that you can make me wear a wig. I have like three options, so I just need to figure it out. Uh, just got to get more wigs because the one I have for space, Dad Shiro needs a good wash because he dirty and fill with a lot of hair gel and spray. Totally understandable. Yeah, I know nothing about taking care of wigs. I have no idea. Also, is this a fucking phoenix? This burby looking like a phoenix. Was she wigging out? Uh, wiggling. You forgot some letters in that word slit. Don't worry. I got you, bud. She was wiggling because they were choking her. Don't hurt me. That'd be... Yeah, that's a pretty... I think it's a phoenix. Where are we? <laughs> no. It's starting again. I need help. Are we playing as Hugo? Wait for me. What? I... Guess we're playing as Tiny Boy Hugo. Okay. This game is very, very pretty. Pretty bird, but also pretty game. I'm just gonna buy wigs and have my friends style them. I yeah, absolutely. There, there are some people who do some really cool styles with wigs. Actually, someone I went to high school. She, she actually does, and she posts it on her uh, Instagram all the time. Hello, Burb. I'm coming for you, Burb. It is a phoenix. Yeah, it totally is a phoenix. He's having some sort of like vision or dream. Oh. Oh, he wants his mommy. His mommy. Maybe he knows where they are. Yes. Maybe they're through here. Yeah, totally, kid. Uh, you, are you not paying attention to the bird that's bursting into flames and popping back up? Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. All right, we up in the pretty factor. Whoa. Amicia? Mommy? Lucas? No, this poor kid. This poor, this poor kid is like tripping right now. I feel bad. Oh. Oh, I can't. I can only run forward. I, I actually cannot move anywhere else but forward right now. We're on tracks now, everybody. Ugh. Poor kid. Oh, the the vi the violin just. Help me, help me. Oh, uh oh. Help me. Find them. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. I don't like this. Oh yeah. Uh. Please, please. Gotta watch out for those French. They are French. What are you talking about? You? <laughs> this takes place in France. I'm pretty sure. So I'm sorry, kid. I'm sorry. I know I'm very, very noisy. I'm coming. You can do it, Hugo. Get to the Walter. Oh, God. Oh, I didn't even think of that. Maybe he got so hit so hard. But I'm like 90% positive he had powers in the first game.
Bird's like, yeah, kid. I was trying to tell you. It's going away. It's the water. You saved me. Thank you. Can I come back here? Or with someone? It speaks to Bird. Uh, I know French kids, rat controlling quitters. It's the window widow maker. <laughs> it's the tale of widow maker. Oh my God. Oh my God. <laughs> Look who's awake. Did you sleep well? It's mommy. Hi mommy. Where are we? Was it your island dream again? Yes. I... I was sick. And then there was a big bird that saved me. But... What happened, Amicia? At the farm? We were playing by the river, remember? But you felt very tired all of a sudden. So I carried you back and you fell asleep. It's probably just a lack of salt in your blood. But, Amicia... It's been a long trip, Hugo. We're all exhausted, but the rest uh, is the end. Mm. You check there. Urina Komodo. Komodo, thank you so much for the follow. And a special welcome to the one and only The Beard Zone. Where I'm eating some chocolate and caramels right now. Uh, but thank you so much, Urino, Urina, for the follow and welcome on in. How are you doing? I paused it because I just didn't I, I didn't want I I wanted to give you the shout out obviously for the fall, but I also want to hear the story. But how are you doing? And welcome on into the beard zone. You can call uh Yuri, you can call me Yuru. Yuri. Okay, Yuri. Is it Yuri or Yuru? Yuri. I'm so, I'm I I believe you mean Yuri. That's what you mean. I'm go because you corrected yourself. Uh but Yuri, welcome on in. How are you doing tonight? Welcome on into our first sesh of my God, I shouldn't have, I got to stop eating these caramels because I cannot talk. Caramel just dunks up my whole mouth. <laughs> uh, but Yuri, welcome on in and welcome on into our first sesh of uh, Plague Tale Requiem. I am absolutely loving this game so far. It is gorgeous and beautiful. Yeah, Story's mom just came in yesterday during our long ass stream yesterday and just goes, here you go, honey. She gave me a whole uh, thing of these, and uh, I love salted caramel candies. Uh, it's milk chocolate caramels with sea salt. It's so freaking good. I'm like, I, I will, I will eat all of them. I gotta, I gotta keep putting them away because I just keep popping one here and there. But yeah, caramel and chocolate, and then like salt, like salt and sweetie, sweet are just. It's such a good combo. Such a really, really good combo. Uh, good, that's good. I'm glad to hear that you're doing well, Yuri. And yeah, don't mind CXC bot. CXC bot's just, you know, fun. It, it likes to think that it's a human. It's our moderation bot. So, uh, but welcome on in. Uh, we just had a trippy dream as Hugo. They know the macula very well. They've been studying it for centuries. Yep, they didn't come to help us in Guienne before we had to flee. They didn't know the Inquisition would come after us. Right, it has to do with the Inquisition. Right. I'm remembering a lot from the yes, first one. They'll make up for it then. They will. The macula is not just in Hugo's blood. It concerns everybody, and it can change everything. Are you ready with your heart, uh, heart play this game? Uh, hello, Freckle. Thank you for the lurk. Um, are you saying that this game is probably very, very emotional, like the first one? Hello. What's going on? We're looking for a boy and a girl. What did they do exactly? They trespassed on a family's property. There was an argument and men were slaughtered. The younger brother witnessed it. Oh, that's horrible. I hope you find the culprits. Oh, I do too. The boys are my nephews. Brother, we need to leave now. Uh oh. Yes. Oh, so it did really happen. Sorry, okay. Uh, we still have quite the road ahead of us. Hello. We won't take long. Boy, it's them. Come here. I'm sorry, it could have been any boy and girl. 
the fact that if they just happen to have a boy and a girl, I'm sorry. Oh shit. Uh, of course the Spanish. Yeah, always the Spanish Inquisition when you least expect it. Uh, th uh, think that I know this game is heartbreaking. Yeah, the fir uh, the first one I remember really fucked around with uh, with my heartstrings. There was a lot that happened. She was right there. She must be still around. Open your eyes. Let's extend the search to the fields. Yes, go away. Yeah, we got him. We got him. God. It must have gone down the hill. Move fast. Unseen. Careful. You can do it. You saw how they devoured Matthias and Remy. How do we kill such monsters? Let's try cutting off their heads. We'll call a priest if we must. Keep going. Yeah, well, I can't really. I'm also playing this on the hardest difficulty. They die, they die. Uh you move dude please just like go that way go go away go away come on french katniss <laughs> time to murder this hunger game oh my god french katniss so let's stop <laughs> all right easy i just need baldy make bald man here appreciate the bald repping the bald it just Oh, I thought I could just like scoot on by past him. Um, French Katniss. What? So this is more hard. Yes. Yeah, so there's easy, medium and hard difficulty. I am playing this on uh, the hardest difficulty uh, because I'm uh, I just like doing that. I'm a masochist. I love playing games on the hardest difficulty. Also, a uh, minion. Hey, guys, gals, and pals, please throw some hype in the chat for the wonderful and amazing minion and his crew. Minion, thank you so much for that beautiful and wonderful raid. Thank you so much, minion and crew, for that raid. Uh, let me go ahead and give minion here a shout out. Hold on a second. Um, guys, gals, and pals, please go drop minion some love that is minion right there he was playing some conan exiles minion i had you open with a lurky my dude how was your stream and uh thank you uh thank you so much for the raid my dude thank you so much for the raid how was conan exiles i honestly you know what? it's funny um that i see that you're doing that you're playing conan exiles i was literally talking to somebody about two recent games i was talking to them about Conan Exiles and I was also talking to them about Rust those are two games that I would be honestly interested in checking out again I've heard that Conan has had like a lot a lot a lot of updates and has changed like drastically uh but how was your stream hello beard zone peeps hello minion peeps how are you doing minion give me one second I also just want to open because I know freckles about a stream I want to have his stream open with a lurk I think he's playing spider-man tonight and then I just wanted to open and because you um, I try to lurk in friend streams while I also stream. So hang on. That's one. That's two. And that's three. There we go. We got three peeps open. Done, done, and done. There we go. Uh, Cancel. There we go. Uh, This game is already hard. Yeah. I, I just... M my philosophy, though, Yuri, is that if I play a, a story game, I like playing the story games on the hardest possible difficulties. So that way I feel like I get like the most experience out of the game and everything, you know? Uh, can I ask you a question? Sure, Slit, what's your question? Uh, I quit playing Conan like a year ago because I was playing solo, but now that friends are in it too, I'm loving it. Oh, so do you guys have like your own server? Or are you, um, or are you guys just playing like on a public server or just like co-op? Oh, I see. It's them. They must be around. Uh, that's what I had to do. I was hitting the wrong button. I was like, I, I don't think I have rocks, but outside. Where are you? Where are you? And I didn't know they had Blink-182 back then in the 1300s. 
Uh, recorded five hours of Playtale Requiem for YouTube Let's Play and didn't check the audio settings, so the footage was useless. Oh no, dude! I'm not even kidding, Minion. I had um, I had a um, a YouTube video a little while ago that that exact issue happened. I fucked up the audio settings because there was like an OBS update. And um. Oh no. Oh no. Ah! Uh, run! Everything's on fire! Oh no! Oh no, 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 no! Oh. Oh. oh, he dead. He's. Is he dead? Yes? You died? That's called karma, bitch. Uh, great game though. Love the first one. Yeah, I'm trying to remember most of the story for first one. I'm I'm blanking out a little bit. <gasps> Holy shit! I'm blanking out on a lot of the story for the first one. Uh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Uh, you can eliminate enemies by shooting their heads with your sling. Eat rock. Oh. oh my god, like one hit and you're just dead. Uh, great game. Love the first one. Yeah, the first one was very, very good. Do you know Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2? Uh, are you talking about the original or the remake? Because both, yes. Uh, I recently just got Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2 and I've been loving it. I don't know if I'm ever going to stream it, but I have been playing it a lot off stream with some friends and uh, really liking it. I'm, I'm honestly liking it. Man, the French are real sensitive about murder. Some may even call them a little torchy. Um, is that French? Because I don't speak French. Uh, you can skim my let's play part. Uh, pl uh, let's play of part one. Uh, I would be down for it. Send me the link. Send me the link. I mean, I do. I, I am subscribed to you, but send me the link because I have smooth brain and I'll forget. Yeah, take that. Oh, fuck. Okay. Well, this is this is very difficult. Right, eat rocks. Okay, now we go back to stealth. That's right, pot has been acquired in inventory. Uh, Lone Star, hello, Lone Star. Welcome on in. How you doing? Yeah. I, I just like, see what I did there with Slit? I'm just reversing his joke and just making a joke of my own. I obviously knew that was a joke. <gasps> oh, fuck. Oh, God, it just like spreads so fast. It just spreads so fast. Excuse me. It's one of my older pieces, my short beard days. Oh, man. So you're saying like three hours ago, right? Oh, oh. I'm leaving. I'm leaving. I'm leaving. Excuse me. Uh, what are we spreading? Uh, butter, fire, and... Um... Fuck you, man. I'm just gonna... Uh, and, and choking hazards. How you doing, Sparkly? Oh, you came in with Minion. Well, hey, anybody from Minion's crew is more than welcome here. We love Minion. Minion's a good dude. We've known Minion for quite some time. How's your day been? It's been good. Um, Pretty much a decent Monday. Um, Very, very chill and low key. Uh, announced some exciting news. We're actually going to be relaunching our merch shop on a different place. <gasps> Mama. That's right. 
Uh, so, got to announce that earlier in the stream, and uh, been enjoying this game so far. And uh, work and everything today has been pretty good. Slay Amicia, heck yeah, we slay. Uh, Loki. Oh no, like low key. Like I'm down low and I dropped my key, Sparkly. And Mama, yeah, that was our mom and we saved her. Those slow nights when you need a refresher, please and thank you because I don't remember, like I remember bits and pieces of the first game because I think it came out in what, like 2018, 2019? So it's been a while. Hey, thank you, Xbox. Thank you for giving me an achievement. That was chapter one. Chapter one done. Easy peasy. I only died like five times. <laughs> uh, I am the okay. Well, that's good, Sparkly. Being okay is always better than not being okay. And how are the Chris? The Chris is doing good. Chris is doing good. Really excited for our relaunch of our merch shop. Uh, we're launching it on a better, more accessible place. And we're going to be coming out with like new designs and have like seasonal stuff and limited time stuff and actually they are super super open to the idea of like if we really wanted like i don't know beard zone salt shakers we could get beard zone salt shakers so they're a lot better than the place that we were using for our original merch shop uh so really excited about that and uh, we're in the process of getting ready to um to set it all up we haven't picked a date on when we're launching it so uh fun fact before i trimmed it my beard went to my belly button Damn, Lone, you have the you had the dream beard. That is how long I've wished I could have gotten my beard. The longest I got to was like midline on my chest, like probably actually probably a little higher, probably like right here, like right above my chesticle area. Uh, and then I had to shave because like all of it because I had a job interview, so I shaved it all off, Sally. But that was like years and years and years ago. That was back in college. Uh, Lone Star X. Well, Lone Star is one of our new friends here. Lone Star doesn't have a sound effect yet, by the way, Sparkly. And uh, in case anyone does, this game loads a really long time. Uh, and in case anybody doesn't know, um, if you become a regular viewer here after watching the stream for 24 hours, you actually do get your own sound effect. Uh, and you can check your watch time by typing an exclamation point Minion, watch time. Look at you. You're in the beard zone. God, it sounded like I was like a, a dying robot there. I hope you enjoy your sound effect, Minnie. I can't believe we made it. <laughs> At your we nipples. Damn. Got a nipple beard going on. Nobody will attack us here, Hugo. Oh, snap. Town is an Lone. Oh, my goodness. Lone, thank you. A new follower. Thank you so much for that follow, Lone. It's a pleasure having you here. Again, anyone from Minions Crew is more than welcome here in the Beard Zone. Uh, thank you so much, Lone, for the follow and a special welcome to the one, the only, the Beard Zone. I can't replicate that. God damn it. I can't replicate the thing that I did for Minion. I swear to God. <laughs> uh, but thank you so much. Thank you so, so much for that, Minion. Really, really appreciate it. Thank you. Something on my face? I'm okay, right? There's nothing on. I think I got a bug on my face. Oh. Go away yet? Okay, I got it. Record Thanks for that. Thank you for that, time. Francis. Appreciate it. Also, welcome on in. It's a good Monday. Found two wholesome creators back to back. You mean Minion and Minion, right? Because Minion's the wholesome one. I'm just the trash beard one. <laughs> Epic moments only happen once. Yeah. But in a moment like this, um, some people wait a lifetime for... I don't know what I'm doing. I have no idea. Uh, water, thank you, Freckle, for the water. Freckle, good luck on your stream, by the way, dude. I got you open with a lurky, my dude. Good luck on uh, playing the new Spider-Man game and stay sticky, my friend. Stay sticky and true and keep getting the stick and the ick. Uh, <laughs> what, you didn't like that, Minion? You're the wholesome one. Yeah, and spelled exactly that way. Wholesome, yes. Freckles, yeah, Freckles streaming right now. Uh, and if you don't know Freckled, Freckles one of our good friends here. So definitely go and check out Freckled, especially if you enjoy Spooderman and uh, being sticky and, uh, you know, just shooting webs out of places in your body. Uh, you should go check out Freckled underscore Ranger, one of my best, best friends. He is going live and uh, very, very late, by the way. Normally he streams like early in the morning, but he's actually streaming late tonight. So definitely swing by and go check out Freckled. Please and thank you. 
who likes being sticky freckled ranger it's it's his slogan he's called freckled ranger and his catchphrase is stay sticky rangers you know he just promotes being sticky and like getting stuck together and everything it's it's a part of his it's his brand uh i am more than the sum of my holes you you know it minion you definitely are reason i had to trim my beard was because my mini weenie likes to walk on my chest and cuddle near my chest while i'm laying down or sitting. oh you have a you have a wiener dog oh they're so cute uh sitting and he would walk on it and shit man talk about pain yeah um luckily enough we we just got a new puppy for anyone that's new here and doesn't know um uh, we just got a puppy he's a husky luckily he's a husky australian shepherd mix his name's indy he just came in here said hi to me and ran away luckily enough he has not nibbled bit or chewed on my beard yet um he's sniffed it a lot but no biting yet of the count not yet wants. he's a very powerful lord but understandable though lone understandable say this is beautiful are you sure the alchemist is waiting for us well magister vordan told me he'd prepared a house for us an entire house yes the order is very old. Imagine they own houses and imagine having a house. house. They built your mother's laboratory and even the Chateau d'Ombrage, remember? Yes. It's nice they give us a house. That's because you're very important to them. Would his majesty allow us to enter the city by his side? I allow. <laughs> fucking kid i swear where am i from i am located in the united states in the uh wonderful state known as new jersey uh we're basically new york's uh neighbor so i live like right next to new york city or new york state i should say go take a quick look with him thank you thanks mama the house is in the upper part of town it has a phoenix weather vane understood oh and be very careful if I were to completely rid myself of my beard, I don't think Harley would love me anymore. Is Harley the name of your dog or is Harley the name of your significant other? Uh, and uh, I think Story, Story of my life, that's my fiance. Um, I think she would still love me if I shaved my beard, but me personally, I think I look really weird and gross without a beard. Um, I have pictures somewhere. Uh, my comparison of me not having a beard is me looking like a turtle. Um, that's how I view myself without a beard. Um, my kids just got used to the beard. Shaving it off now might traumatize them. They're like, where did dad go? Dad disappeared. <laughs> goats. The OG beard. Goats. The original beards. <laughs> Haven't shaved in a long time. Only trip. Francis, I didn't know that you have a beard, dude, or facial hair. Roasted meats. <gasps> Roasted meats. Yes, please. Oh, I will have all so meats, good. please. Hey, come on. Try a little piece. Go on. Oh, yum. <laughs> you like it? Yes. <sighs> it's not piggies, right? Um, <laughs> come on. Let's go see the rest. <laughs> yes. When the kid finds out that <laughs> pig <laughs> bacon is, is pigs. Oh, that no. good. I'm hungry now. Let's keep going before you ask for more. That night dude looked cool. Uh, yeah, Harley is our mini Winnie. My wife probably wouldn't love me anymore either. I've had this beard for seven years now. Seven years. Jeez, that's some that's some high beard stats you got there, Lone Star. Uh, well, not a beard, but it's uh the one on my chin, and I keep it shaped. Oh, nice. So like like a like a goatee. I used to rock a goatee for years, actually. Make deals at our fish auction and try your skills in a free session of a shooting game. Shooting game. Tomorrow's event is the long-awaited cow fair. Get ready to overbid. Oh, the cow, cow fair. Of all wishes you all an cow fair. John Cows fair. and shooting and fish. This is my kind of village. Where's the shooting game? I want to shoot things. The is just a precaution. Because of the arena pigs, you know? Oh, the yes. I heard all the livestock from the whole arena is gone. The I arena think. pigs? Things like hell over there. The arena pigs? Do they put them like in armor and shit? Our stocks are getting low. What is an arena pig? It's I need to know. I, I need, to, need to know. What is an arena pig? I'm Googling this. I have to know. What the fuck is an arena pig? Hold on. Arena pig. What is an arena pig? 
Oh my god, it's literally like pigs co uh, competing in a ring, like running around and shit like that. What the fuck? I've never heard of that before. They have arena pigs. What the hell? What is this? <laughs> I've never heard of arena pigs. Uh, well, not as long as some people have it, but just up to my chin. So there's something there. Oh, I gotcha. I gotcha. Listen, again, that's that's literally what I had. What? The people here. They're smiling. Uh, it's true. Oh, look up there. The house with the weather vane. That's ours. Oh, oh that's a big house. It? Hugo, yes. uh, Hugo is Hugo cute. Amazing. Hugo is cute. And I love the brother-sister dynamic, like... Amisha is, is such a good sister and really cares for her brother. Oh, it's like a bazaar. Oh. Brushes and combs from Firenze. Try them. My lady, why not change your hairstyle? Thank you, but I like it like this. Oh, good for you. A woman's hair is her righteous crown. Beautifully said. Your hair is nice like that. Well, thank you, sir. Spurs. Arm wrestling. Sure. But yeah, I, I love their dynamic because she is really just a good older sister and really loves her brother and it's just it's so this it's so wholesome. I had a closet like that in my oh, this wine. A present for your father, maybe. He's dead. But he loved this wine. Oh, well, he was a very fine man then. Oh. He was. Thank you. Yeah, that I remember from the first one. Oh, look at this furniture. Hand carved. Um, where am I going? Look at the colors. Just imagine the clothes you can make with this. The most beautiful clothes, you can be sure. Are you interested in any? <laughs> I'm interested in too many. Ain't that the truth? <laughs> That's how I feel like with my clothes. Uh, their interactions have all the. F yeah, it's just so cute. It's too. It's too cute. Like I wish me and my brother were like this. We were not like this growing up. We also, we also did not grow up in the 1300s. But still, like, just good, good brother sibling dynamic in this game. Um, herb. More meats? Lots of meats. Oh, the shooting game! A gift to our visitors from the Count of All. A game? What do you say, lady? You look like a winner. I am a winner, yes. Yes. All right. So how do we play this? You get four shots to knock down as many cups as you can. Got it? I'm in. Do I have to use these mini catapults? Easy. Okay. Lone underscore okay. triple X said water. Oh, I have to get a new one. Uh, same, wait, future. same as in you didn't grow up in the 1300s or same you wish that you and your sibling <laughs> were closer like these two. I'm kind of like uh, like this with my little brother, but he's at the same time annoying. Water the whole thing. Don't drink for now. Drink for the future. I'm not. Hold on. Hold on. I don't think you know how much water I have on every stream. Um, I'm not drinking this whole thing at once. It's a sip <laughs> alone. I would die if I drank this whole entire thing. This is a, a whole ass gallon water bottle. Uh, I will take a sip for you, and I appreciate you thinking about my thirst, but I don't feel like having my cells explode from too much water, so. <laughs> Throw it at the little brother. That's the kind of dynamic that my brother and I had. <laughs> But uh, thank you for the hydrate, but I will not I will not be drinking the whole entire thing. No, thank you. <laughs> uh, that's what sibling. Uh, that's what sibling mean. Yeah, absolutely. You probably would drown. Yes. Yeah. Did you, did you have you guys ever heard that story about the person who uh, they were doing some sort of contest? Hang on right there. You're great. That was close. Heck yeah. All righty. Right there. Going. Okay. And then I got two, so I should probably go for like right here. And then right. Of course I did. 
What Here. did you expect? You're our best player today. And you didn't even use your sling. I think we have to get going. Thank you. Best Bye. player! Yeah! Best player. Heck yeah. Heck yeah. <laughs> Uh, PP time? No PP yet. I'm fine right now. I can do it. I mean, I probably would be able to get through a decent amount, but I don't feel like drowning myself right now. But appreciate the thought, though, Lone. Hydration, Roots, important. The finest. Make sure you stay hydrated. Oh, they're beautiful. Thank you. I make them. Do you know how to play? No, I never took the time to learn. But she's a good shot. Evil. Yeah, Demo's been here the whole time. I could play. Uh, his 50 gal Texas oil drum barrel. Yes. Also, this is my, my second one of this one because I dropped my other one the other day and it shattered into a million pieces because of the, of gravity. <laughs> gravity is the ultimate champion and, uh, it shattered in a bunch of pieces. So I had to order a brand new one. <gasps> fire breathing. Slit does this guys. Slit does fire breathing and fire eating. Slit, are you here? Is this good form? Dragons. Slit actually does fire breathing, by the way. I'm not I'm not even kidding. Uh item number one or Hugo number one. Item number one or Hugo number one? I mean Hugo's adorable. How could you not pick Hugo? There was a person addicted to water and they drowned by drinking too much water. Uh, we're technically all addicted to water, but, uh, the story, the story that I was thinking of, the story what I was thinking of was that there was some, sunflowers, but yeah, there was a, uh, a competition on some radio show and the, uh, it was like a water drinking challenge. And whoever drank the most water won like a Nintendo Wii. This is like a few years ago. And supposedly this person drank like two gallons of water in a very short amount of time. And there's there, there, this person literally drowned from the inside out. They literally drowned from the inside out because they drank too much water. And uh, basically what happened was that their, their cells like overloaded on water and then bursted. And then they internally drowned. Um... And this, again, this is like years and years and years ago. I remember reading like or hearing about it on the news and shit like that. It was crazy. Uh, no way sparkly. Yeah, it, yeah, that can happen. Um, I think just me item number. Oh, so you would choose an item over Hugo? <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> He's so cute, though. Holy shit. Yeah, I'll have to see if I can find the article, but it, it's. I forget. There's an actual name for it. It's like Hydro. Placity, hydro something, and like the term just basically means your cells have too much water. I'm dying, mom, but I I won <laughs> I won the Wii U. <laughs> it wasn't even a Wii U, it was like Nintendo Wii. In my opinion, not even worth it. <laughs> oh, she's gonna lift him up. Oh, Oh, this is too cute. Yeah. Your cells can have too much oxygen too? Yeah. Did you know actually like pure oh uh like oxygen? Pure like oxygen is actually considered a legal it's it's a actual drug. Like oxygen like containers, like pure like oxygen is actually considered a drug. Yes, but it's great. We really need item though, so uh, so it's okay. Yeah, yeah, Hugo will understand. Right? <laughs> Is he like, um, I thought he was like covering Amisha's eyes. <laughs> Aww, we can walk around with the pig. Aww, this is too cute. This is too, too cute. I can imagine. I believe in it. I believe in you, Sparkly. You have a great imagination. Yeah, I really like this place, but um, I got some, I got some, 
storytelling sense going on that uh things are gonna things are gonna go from good to bad eventually yeah we should go check out this house I just hope they have real beds I hope I can see the market from my room a little tiny kid goodbye of course Chris is the real drug yeah someone's had a long day sure I'm a drug um drugs are bad <laughs> that's all I got uh where is the house oh is this the house oh I think this is the house oh church the Jeebus all right I'm gonna go this way nope we gotta go to Bejeebus land hold on can we run Oh, it is the church. Oh, we're right next to the church. Oh. Hey, you're back. So how was it? They've got everything. <laughs> it's true. We'll have to go back. <laughs> I can't sure. handle drug. Please Me too. Same here, Yuri. Oh. Look at that. I think we can call it home. Yes. Home. That's pretty. That word this while. game is really pretty. I'm glad we came. <sighs> and I think someone needs to take a nap. I'm not tired. <laughs> sure. Let's go see inside. Ah, it's a, hold on. I just want to take... Really, really pretty landscape. There's a port down there and everything. God damn. Pretty, pretty game. Hey, Chris. XD, XD, XD. Wait, why was the last Ooh, XD just the lowercase quiet. XD? That has me concerned, Sparkly. Are you okay? Are you trying to send me a message? Are you, is everything all right? Ready to come inside? Yes, lead the way. Give us the grand tour, please. We're home, Hugo. Our new home. Let's take a look around. Sparkly, blink three times if everything's okay, please. Yes. All right, we'll do that later. Mother. Where's Hugo's room? He's exhausted. Upstairs. The bed is ready. Thanks. Come on, you sleep. Okay, you blinked repeatedly. So everything's not okay then. Because it wasn't three times. You must come, Amicia. Oh. Come where? The island. He'll be healed there too. Healed? Well, that would be nice, I'm sure. It will be. Why are your lotteries so absurd? What, you mean like United States like lotteries? You're thinking too Demo, are your eyes okay? You're blinking a whole lot. Your feelings. I'm trying this, is this a new bit now? <laughs> we're just typing that we're blinking now? I get stuck in the logic of it. Substances obey natural law. The macula does too. You don't need logic, Lucas. You just need to be human. Maybe I'm just not very good at being human. You are. Me this too. <laughs> Me too. Oh, right. Amicia. Amicia. Uh oh the macula it's the shock what happened today must have woken it right it, it's when some sort of like right after he passed the second threshold but the balance of his blood is very delicate i'm gonna have to Amicia, like read up on what happened this. in the first one magister verdan is somewhere in this town find him and tell him to come quickly right away because i forget what the macula is actually Amicia, i know we'll be careful uh, yes, Powerball is at 1.9 billion. Hugo is fine. Yes, I agree. And I don't know, honestly. I really don't know. They've always been crazy. Those farmers, I should never. <sighs> yeah, I don't remember what the Macua is. How can you be so sure? You can't Wasn't the first one in French? Um, keeps evolving. Uh, you mean in France or you mean language-wise in France? Uh, in French, because you can change the language whenever you want, but... 
this does place in this this does take place in 13 uh 1300 uh france um so you can potentially just change the language if you want but uh i don't know how to speak french so me and my wife are going to win i hope so i hope everyone could win it like honestly 1.9 billion dollars is crazy um I would share it i would honestly share and like donate if i ever won that much money that's too much money for any one person to have <laughs> at that point you could have everything quite a few times you know what i mean uh gunzoon tight francis je ne parle pas francis yeah same here yeah exactly what you said sparkly me too why hasn't Vodan shown up already? I think he's just being discreet. The order works like this. Someone must know about him. Let's ask around. Yeah, nobody should own a billion dollars in today's economy. Yeah. Uh, with all the money from the Powerball, I'm having my consciousness downloaded to Minecraft. I'll live there forever. Oh, same. Same. Actually, you know, uh, I, I know I keep going off on tangents and just, you know, uh, but... I just read an article about how someone uh, did something with AI the other day. You know how like there's that AI generated art stuff. So someone put in a prompt uh, human evolution to see what this AI would generate. And according to this AI, um, human evolution, our next step in evolution is us. Uh, this, this AI came up with it. Uh, its next step was to... Um, uh, our human evolution is that we're going to be uh, downloading our consciousnesses into robot bodies. Um, and it like drew pictures of like humans being like sort of like cyberpunky and then just full on robots. So I thought that was it was like really cool. I'm like, oh, cool. We're going to be robots in the future. That's dope. Just download me. Download me on your your robot brain, please. Uh, I said I don't speak French. Yeah, same. That's why I said me too, for sure. Who, me? Yeah. So what you said earlier, France, uh, Francis Gunzuntite. Um, I would totally go full on. Me too. I would go full on robot. I would even do like cyberpunk, like augmentations and shit like that. I, I would, I would, I would do that. Hello, guard. Uh, hello. Excuse me. Would you know the whereabouts of Magister Vaudin? Uh, I've heard of a Sir Vaudin, not a Magister. Try the marketplace. There's a couple of florists there. I think they deal with him from time to time. Thank you. What a nice guard. Okay. Uh, I'd rather put my consciousness into a ship with cameras and launch into space. I would, I would do that too. We came by the florist earlier. Just send me off into space. Oh, you know what? That reminds me of the game Soma. I think that was like a big plot point in the game Soma. Very, very good spoopy game. If anybody likes spoopy games. Hello again. Oh, it's you. Looking for flowers for the little one? Actually, I'm looking for Sir Vaudan. I believe he's one of your clients. He's my husband's client. He's the one who deals in medicinal herbs. Oh, but Morton should be right by the fountain. Just tell him I sent you. He's wearing a brown tunic. Brown tunic. Ah, uh, brown, so nobody knows that he pooped his pants. Gotcha. The ultimate camouflage. <laughs> uh, I also saw an AI drawing our evolution as heads replaced by torso tops, so we have boobs on boobs. The ultimate configuration. That's boobs on boobs us. on boobs. Uh, fountain. Fountain, fountain. Where the hell is the fountain? Excuse me, sir. Your wife sent us. Oh, is this the guy? Now, what does she want now? I'm busy cleaning this mess. It's not oh. for her. Fountain. We must find Him? But he doesn't like to be bothered. Just like me. Listen, my brother is very sick. We need him immediately. Oh. All right, all right. I don't know precisely where, but I think he lives close to the arena. Oh. Down there. Oh my God. Don't tell him I sent you. Don't worry. Thank you. Nobody right. knows Let's where this fucking dude is. Oh my god. Um nice for now. Yeah, very nice. Um night everyone. Have a wonderful stream, Chris. Just take care. Have a wonderful night. I hope that you're feeling better. Uh I hope that your cat is also feeling better. And thank you so much for coming in and hanging out with us, Jess. Please take care. 
Uh, but when we win, our plan is to buy a large plot of land and have homes built for all our family in a small community and everyone retired and self-sustainable. That's that's pretty that's pretty awesome though. That's honestly uh, honestly a really really good plan. I like that one loan. That's a lot of houses. How are we going to find him? There's mischief in the air. I can feel it. Yes. That's why I keep the children inside. Okay. Uh, hello, my dudes. You plant those sunflowers. It's a slum. The order's not poor, so what would a magister be doing here? Probably hiding. Probably. <laughs> Duck! 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 Amicia, that symbol on the wall. The order? Yes. He's in here. No one gets in. The arena is off limits. Why is that? Because the Count of Provence said so. Get going, please. Listen, I really need to pass. It's all right. Come. We'll go around the arena. <sighs> Now's not the time to argue with soldiers. Yeah. You're right. Sorry. There's a door up there. Yes. I like the, the music in this game. The audio is very, very good. Uh, I hear a lot of people dream of such communities, uh, but do you really want to see your relatives all the time? Our family is very family oriented. Yeah, some families are very, very tight. And like, I mean, that that's absolutely fine. Nothing wrong with that. But I think that's like a ready to break the law. Breaking the law, breaking the law. Um, you know, um, some families are very, very tight like that. I, it's very rare for me to see like a lot of my like relatives and stuff like that. We're spread all over the place. Um, and I, it's, it's hard to, to meet up and see them and stuff like that. So, um, a two years old birthday, birthday party starts at 2 PM and ends at 3 AM. Jeez. That's a crazy part. That sounds like my old, like back in the day growing up, that's how my family was. And then we all just kind of like got into our own, own things and dealings and everything like that. Our, our family, we still keep in touch, but. Is it? The bite. Yes. They've locked the arena down. They let them die here. Oh shit. Starting all over again. Not starting. Spreading. Hugo. Uh oh. We brought it here. Let's find Magister Voda. If he's not dead already. Spooky. Oh no. Uh, I don't find this game spooky. Even though it does have some spooky tones sparkly. But uh, I don't find it really that spooky. So good try, but those sound effects are turned off. How come nobody noticed their disappearance? Maybe nobody cares. Maybe. Uh, is there no crowd control? Yeah, this game does not have any kind of crowd control. Also, welcome on back, Leo. How are you doing? Essentially, there's a family function nearly every weekend. Damn, that is a very, very tightly knit family then. Here, another symbol. Well, let's get in then. Spook Vember must must live. Well, no. Well, so we were playing some spooky games yesterday. We were playing Signalis, which is basically like a Resident Evil type game, and we were also playing some Ghost Song, uh, which had some spooky vibes. But the spooky games to... always keep coming. Love the spooky games. Yes. I'm also excited for next month. Look, an opening up there. There must be a way to climb up. Puzzle. I already this have. Help. I'll give you a hand. Already figured this shit out. Um, or and that to orient it. Okay, so we want to. Here. He's in trouble. He knows the bite. He must be avoiding the sick. This because way. Uh, but I'm excited for it next it month. It means. Cause uh, what's what? coming out next month? Oh, um, the Callisto Protocol comes out next month, and I'm very excited for that game. Spoobums are good. Yeah, I love spooky games. This game's got some spoopy undertones, but it's not full on horror. Uh-oh. I don't know him. I swear. You piece of no good. He has a helmet. I can't do anything. What do we do? Let's just pass. Not a sound. You're alone. And I have all the time in the world. Just Yeah, I can't I can't do anything to helmet peeps. Let me go. A single coin. No. How many are there? Uh oh. 
If I find him, I can ask for a reward. Anisia, he'll see us. I'll make him move. Thank that bastard Cal for letting you die like a dog. Uh... Damn, that's an ugly death. Oh, we can go off on the right. Uh, let's get a rock. Boop. That's it. Go away. Yeah, what get out of here. Dumb nightman. Uh, pretty right just here in the back. I gotcha. I gotcha. This game is very, very good so far. I am honestly really enjoying it. <laughs> it's very, very good. Uh, nice dude. Callisto protocol is going to be so fucking amazing. I am very excited and you can definitely guarantee I will be playing and streaming that game. Shit. This was there after I think he's a doctor. Oh, just a look. Hey. Then stop looting and look for this bloody alchemist. Ah, someone will find him. Why is he making so much noise? Focus on that, dude. Focus on that pile of, uh, pit, uh, pokies. Oh, but I could go up there. Uh, this door? Yes. Okay. Uh, I remember first seeing the trailer and I was like, this is going to be good. It has to be. Yeah, it looks really good. There was a there was another gameplay trailer of it a little while ago, and uh, it has me excited because Dead Space is one of my favorite spooky games like of all time, specifically Dead Space 1, which we're also getting a Dead Space 1 remake, which I will also be playing on stream. I, I am already planning on doing both those games. Uh, what did you eat today? Um, uh, let's see. What did I eat today? I had some hard-boiled eggs and a piece of toast this morning. Had some leftover burrito bowl. And for dinner, we had uh, steak, rice, and some Brussels sprouts. It was a good day. Good day for foods. Uh, why is that the dumb guy live in a play kind of this kind of place? Um, maybe because he's trying to like lay low like someone's after him or hey, something like that or Let's maybe this is chat. how he likes to live maybe um but um i don't think it was this place was always like this with the bodies and everything specifically so uh don't worry that's just a computer yeah but we still love cxc bot oh, oh god that's a lot of bodies <laughs> Isn't that right, CXC bot? CXC bot didn't respond to me this time. Why? Because it's insulted. Quick. But. <gasps> Piggy. Oh, you're eating the bodies. Oh. Oh, they're eating the bodies. Yep. Yep, they're eating the bodies. Yep, pigs. Half caught here. Right. It's not high enough. I think they were moving the bodies with it. Oh, that cage up there looks the right size. Ugh. It's full of bodies. Oh. Yeah. Oh, don't look at that. Ewe. Ewe. Lots of bot. Oh, there's limbs. Let's push That's it. gross. Uh, I just realized you're playing the sequel. To, uh, to, yeah. Uh, first one was called Plague Tale Innocence, and this is Plague Tale Re uh, Requiem. Requiem. Uh, but hello, free. Welcome yes, on in, dude. They would have seen it coming. It wouldn't have changed yeah, no rats yet, but they're coming. I guarantee it. <laughs> CXC bot. I'm sorry. Are you just apologizing to CXC bot? I just got done eating and saw this after. Yep. Um, lots of dead bodies. Not good for an appetite. But for the pigs, great. Ten out of ten. Good meal. Look, I think they were keeping count of the dead. What is that? They left a knife. Oh. It's stuck. Come on. Got a knife. No. Well, let's keep going. One kniff. Nice. Looks delicious. Yeah, totally delicious. Also, hey, Gif, how are you doing, man? Sup, nerds? Yeah, we are nerds. What about it? Being a nerd is cool. 
what the knife looks delicious or the the pigs look delicious or the pigs eating the bodies looks delicious there's a lot of options you got there francis pig vitamin yeah this is how bacon gets its flavor this is how the bacon gets that delicious crunchy flavor right all right uh i wonder if now since i have the knife if i can do a cecil nations on the the armor dudes look over there another symbol good but because if these people fell ill it means some must have been bitten i've seen no signs of attack not yet anyway let's go yeah it might be it might be too early because i remember if you get bit obviously some people die but something else happens if i'm not mistaken oh Arno. Guess that's their their boss. Uh, all right, we gotta get to that door over there. So, uh, one time I had a seizure watching Santa Carlito. Oh, that show! I remember that show. While eating Domino's pizza, it was the worst. Chris Drew Barrymore pulled out an eyeball or something and ate it, and it just defeated me. Yeah, that show's pretty gory. Wait for that archer guy to move. Uh, just got done playing Gardic Phone and Raft with a buddy on his stream, getting ready to head to bed. Oh, nice! Was it was it a good time? We come here looking for a damn alchemist. We find a mass grave. It's fine. Let's just stay here waiting for death. Right. What? Oh. What's that asshole? I know what I'm doing. Hey. Ah, oh, shit. Ah, oh, shit. Ah. Oh. We're leaving. We're leaving. We're leaving. Goodbye. We did. But I'm weary of the thieves, murderers, mercenaries. All the bloody scum that keeps getting in our way. Chaos rules our lives. They're part of it. And you're getting better at handling them. I see it. You didn't leave much alive back there. Yes. That's probably why we're still alive to talk about it. Uh, the way you handle situations influence the evolution. Oh, okay. Oh, so depending on what I do. So we'll get me different perks. Interesting. So we have prudence, uh, which I guess is stealth. It looks like stealth. Aggressive. Um, uh, Amisa will automatically increase the mastery of her three skill types depending on your approach. Oh, that's cool. So it's like, depending on your play style, you'll get these perks. And opportunism. Um, thanks to a better knowledge of alchemy, crafts uh, alchem alchemical ammo faster. Interesting. That's cool. And hey, that's me being the best shot ever. I was the best player for that. So, because I got such great aim um when will you end stream um so i stream every monday tuesday friday yuri at 7 p.m est that's eastern standard time and i usually go to 1 a.m eastern standard time uh so it's 10 06 right now for me so probably for another three hours um usually usually i end around like 1 a.m yes yeah uh, it was pretty fun. Always fun turning his chat against him. Got a lot of team gift going. Heck yeah. Love that, man. Love that. Uh, hello, Flam Ita. Hi, Dylan. Are you okay? <laughs> uh, interesting way to level up in this game. Yeah, that's really, really cool. I honestly like that as a leveling system. Um, have nothing in stealth right now. You smell that. Dead bodies. What is this place? A hospital like a failed hospital 
Ja, uh, okej. Okay. Keep away from the bodies, dude. Give them bodies some some distance, cause disease is. Yeah, definitely an interesting way to level up. Uh, yeah, I also stream on Sundays, usually starting at 12 p.m. EST, and my uh, Sundays Sunday stream day is my long stream day. Uh, what's up this way? I'm gonna see if there's any like collectibles or anything. This one's still alive. Oh. Lady. Oh. Alice. It's you. I'm I'm not Alice. Uh oh. Promise you'll take care of it yourself. I will be at peace. I did nothing. Let's go. Well, oh, new souvenir. Be at peace. Can we stop it, Lucas? You mean the bite? Yes, but if we kill Hugo. The real question is, will it stop the rats? I don't know yet. We still haven't seen one. If they're here, they're hiding from the sun, waiting. Right, because the knights would only, they don't like the sunlight, so they would only come out at night. So that's why we haven't seen any rats yet. Um, and that's why they went in here because this place is dark, but we still haven't seen any rats inside. Please tell me this is it. And more dead dudes. Uh, I don't know how you work staying up till 1 a.m. You crazy. My old bum is tired. If I stay up past 10, dude, I, I feel it now. Now that I'm like, now I'm 31. I feel it some days. Some days, like oh I, God. I really, really feel it. It's a whole city. The symbol. He's in that tower. He has to be. Has to. Lucas, crossing this mess won't be easy or quick. It's the order. A high magister would just live in a high tower, no? <sighs> Let's just get there. Yeah, this be a whole ass fucking city here. Jesus. Uh, but I don't know how I do it, but I, I'm used to it. Also, my job's pretty flexible and I, I, I work a nine to five and I do work from home. So. Well, it's the only way. But just be careful. Lucas, ease. Don't, don't, don't. God damn it. Okay, I was about to say on a rickety platform. This game looks beautifully sad. Um, I get what you mean. Like, like the undertones are like, it's like sad of a premise. Oh no, Lucas. Oh no. Oh no, we gotta run. We gotta go. We gotta go. But yeah, game is so far gorgeous. Amicia, Amicia is a head rock person. <laughs> Some say that she's hard headed. Oh. Please don't hurt me. Calm down. We're not with those men. You live here? Yes. Oh no. Oh no. It's. No. 
We've got light. We're safe for now. We're safe. We're Stay safe. close to the light source to protect God. yourself from the rats. You can interact with the torch. Keep hold of me. You think we can get out of this? We must. Yep. Let's go carefully. Rat physics, everybody. I told you they were here. There are millions of them. How? How can there be so many already? Hugo. They're here for him. Rat physics. Jesus Christ. I forgot how crazy this was. I forgot how crazy this was, like the first one. That will hold. Look, they're climbing. What? How? This is so bad. We get to that tower, get Boda, bring him back to Hugo, and leave. World premiere. Uh, in the real world, they just contracted the plague being uh, that close to to that many breathing the same air that monstrosity that is a horde of rats. Yeah, I mean, well, I mean, especially with like the black plague. My materials. I lost all of it in the fall. We'll do without. Um, yes. That's how a lot of much. like diseases and, and things like the black plague spread. Whether it be like living within close proximity of one another, and then also just uh, I think we can climb that wall. We can't cross high up. Oh, okay, right, right, right. We have to put the torch down here. I can't believe you're leaving the torch behind. Oh, don't worry. There's more torches. Nasty filth. What do we do? Let's use a stick. It'll burn fast. We'll keep a straight From line. Yes, very straight. Okay. Lurk. All right, Gif. You go lurk, man. Go have a good night. Go get some sleep, my dude. Okay. This is reminding me of Dishonored. Oh, yeah. Oh, actually, speaking of Dishonored, by the way, Francis, have you ever played the game? Uh, have you ever played the game Deathloop? Uh, because it's by the same developers who made uh, Dishonored. One at a time. We can make it. We're making it. And uh, they actually just announced. It work. Time to light it up. Isn't there like? Uh, they, yeah. Well, they just announced that Deathloop is now. Um, is officially in the same exact world as Dishonored. Um, somehow. I didn't get a chance to read the full article, but yeah, Deathloop, very, very good. If you like the Dishonored games, I highly recommend check out Deathloop. Ooh, lots of freaking rats, man. Lots of rats. Who said shadows some people watch openly? <laughs> Uh, you rang. Uh, I've heard of that. Actually, yeah, Deathloop, very, very good game. I enjoyed it. Um, and it's kind of like a roguelike almost. It's like a roguelike Dishonored with guns. I think that's a good example of really? to explain that a game. Beam? It's the only way. Right. Steady. Wow. All right. Just don't rush. Oh, no. <gasps> Oh no, Lucas! No, I'm surrounded. The ladder, get to high ground, quick! Yes, of course it had to happen to me. Yeah, this whole if oh, they're coming home to me. Stay calm. You're fine for now. Oh my God! I won't let you down. You know it. <laughs> this abuse. That would be. Like, I'm not afraid of rats, but this many rats? This is way too many. Oh, please, 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 please. Yes. The hell out of here, rats. Good. That will do. Nice. I'll try to join you. I'll need a stick to get across. Uh, take the stick. All right. Oh, we gotta throw the sticks. Be brave and don't fall this time. You can do it. Uh, too late for that. 
<laughs> He's like freaking the hell out. Get up here. Get up here, you beautiful boy. Come on. Thank you. Please stop giving me cold sweats. Let's keep going. Wanna fight weenie boy? <laughs> Are you insulting my moderation bot and calling it a weenie? Uh, I love Dishonor, but I couldn't play part two. Triggered my phobia too hard. Yeah, um, I totally get that. I totally, totally get that part. Dishonored 2 was, was, it was good. It was good, but I can totally see that. Uh, I've actually been missing Dishonor recently. I, uh, it's so funny because whenever, um, I forgot the developers of Dishonor. Whenever they announce something new, people are like, Dishonor 3, Dishonor 3. And then they're like, nah, we're working on something new. It will be. Kobe. Anisha is, uh, Anisha is a, uh, crack shot. She's the ultimate sniper. Oh, no. We're going down again? We are. It's a joke. We gotta go down to go up. And Hugo's condition gets worse with every second we spend here. Your mother is with him. He should be fine. Beautiful boy. Yeah, slay, Lucas, slay. Kobe. Lucas is a sweetheart. But they were here not long ago. Look at these bodies. Fresh. They're close. Careful. We're gonna have to run, aren't we? I'm calling it. We're gonna have to sprint down this hallway. I'm just waiting to hear the rats just morph behind us. In for it. Yeah. Okay. Oh. What is that? Rails in the walls. It looks like an elevator. It could be a way out. Is that a freaking mammoth skull? Excuse me? Lucas. Or an elephant? Thing. I read about this. It's an elephant. Why did I go mammoth? Romans use them during circus games. It's enormous. Look yep. at it. Elephants teeth. be huge. This is surreal. Yes. There's enough bones around. Let's get out of here. Okay. So we got an elevator and I see a big old torch in the middle of that elevator. That's We're going to have to. I know it. It's sulfur. It's a smithy, a crank. Let's see what it does. I'm going to need you. Sure. Uh. Wow. Oh no. Do you hear that? Oh no, please no. There's so many now. We're stuck, Lucas. No, no. Look at the platform, the brazier. It looks big enough to light the whole room. How do we set it on fire? I don't know. Saltpeter, sulfur, alcohol, whatever we can find. Fine. These rooms are open now. Maybe we'll find something. Please don't climb up. That's sulfur, right? Yes. Some spilled on these planks. The chest up there might contain more. Okay. That sulfur would be perfect. Let's get yeah, up. Yeah, this Come. is uh. There's an elevator. Puzzle time. That's another thing I. Oh. Of course. You're doing all right. Well, having the time of my life. I have to hold it. Okay. Holding it. Order. Oh, hold. Wait. What did it say? Uh, okay. I have to tell him. Lucas, oh. I need you to take care of this. Naturally. Gotcha. Okay. All right. I was a little confused there. <laughs> Thanks, Lucas. You demand. We're losing time. Listen, we slow is fast. Fast is slow. You ever hear of that saying? It's the truth. Never rush things. If you don't have to rush things. Can I not get this? Oh, I know. I got to put it on the, uh, on the cart thing here. The elevator thing. On your go. You can stop now. Of course. All right. Now we can go get the cart and then we can move it. Big brain. Big brain. I love puzzles. I really, really do. We need to move faster. I'm worried about Hugo. The tower's not that far. As soon as we find Vodan, he'll... We don't even know if he's in there. 
I'm with the rats and those mercenaries. Also, what is this guy supposed to be doing for us? Yes. What is he supposed to be doing for us? Good. So, found anything? You were right. Oh no, this it's guy that we're looking for, Verd Verdun. Like, what is he right. supposed to be helping us with or doing? Ignifer. Remember? Ignifer. I forgot about this. Let's check that other room. Need stock. We need oh, stock. he's an expert on Hugo's condition. I probably missed that. Maybe in that chest. All right. Let's try to keep these rats occupied first. Huh. Oh, right, right, right. Okay. So I can do that and then run over and get that. I must have missed that. We need to get rid of those rats first. Get rid of the rats. What am I missing? It's too dangerous with the rats down there. What am I? Oh, wait a minute. Can I? <gasps> Aha. Thank you, Lucas. Whoa, thank you. I saw I So like it seems like certain objects have like a texture on it to show that, but thank you. Thank you, Yuri. They'll like this. Oh no. It looks safe. Good. Let's get to that chest. God, they still look like they haven't eaten in a million years. Yeah, they uh they're like little piranhas. So, what's in it? Alcohol bottles. Yes, that's good. Very good. Come back. Girl, don't be don't be messing around. Go, go, go. They're eventually gonna eat finish that meat. Good. We have sulfur and alcohol. It's one of the best bases for an ignifer. Highly reactive. Mix them together. Ignifer. Crafting time. Now you can craft Ignifer. Open the menu. Uh select Ignifer and craft. One, two, four. Uh all your mansion be shot and out of any of your weapons. Okay. Done. Shoot it at those embers with your sling and well, hope that it works. <laughs> that was highly reactive indeed. Thanks, Lucas. That ignifer will be more than useful. Now let's try to get that platform down. I think I've seen other cranks around. We'll have a look. Nice. I think we just made did we make thermite? I honestly don't know what makes up thermite. Other than that episode of, Other than that episode of uh Breaking Bad, where they take a bunch of etched sketches. Wow, that's a lot of antique jars. I can easily picture a crowd getting heated with wine while gladiators fight. Yes, something's never change. Alcohol and sulfur. Oh, we can make a lot of ignifer. Uh, how do I do my aiming thingy again? Okay, so rock. And ha. Okay. Oh, I can quick switch like that. Okay. Oh, and I can quick craft. Oh, that's cool. Very, very cool. All right, so we can just go over here now. Oh, there are still rats left. That clay pot you have, it could concentrate the effect of an ignifer and release it on impact. Go on, try. Let's hope it works. Oh. Hold the R. Here. It's done. Throw it to make a brief fire. It'll get us across, but we'll have to be caught. No. Yes, move. Oh, that's cool. Okay. You just need a pot. 
Interesting. Okay, so we can use different things to make different types of ammo. Very, very cool. I like that. That's that's pretty cool. All right. Let's Ah, uh, oh, fuck. That thing is too heavy. That's what the crank on the other side is for. You need two people. All right. You stay there. I'll go man that other one. I'll wait for you go. This is it, Amicia. Hopefully. If someone had told me we'd have our own circus games. If someone had told me the world was about to collapse again. This is why item number one. I mean, I see, I see what you mean now, Yuri. <laughs> I see what you mean now. Uh, all right. So, infer and hit. Oh, and I can switch. Oh, that's so nifty. I don't have to go into the menu every time. They had more beasts in there. Very, very cool. I'll bring help, Hugo. I'll find this photo, but you have to hold on. I'm doing my best. Ha. Okay, but there's still still rats in the way. So hiya. So that and that. Enjoy the snacky. To the crank now. Time to get that lift down and get the hell out of here. All Enjoy right, the it's snack, it's rats. It's working. I can't believe it. Thank the Lord. This is it. On your word. Go. Um, that? That break, breaking. Let's get to the lift. Quick. Steady. Huh. Nice. How did we do this with exceptional skills and resilience. <laughs> I like Lucas. Was Lucas in the first one? I don't. He seems so familiar, but I don't remember. I think I think he was right. I do. I think he was in the first one. Been through this before. You saw how they charged us. The way they move. They're faster, more agile, more intelligent. But we made it. Barely. Let's find Magister Bodin. With the order by our side, we won't have to face this alone anymore. I really hope that you're right. Also, I hope it's not dark now. Please tell me we didn't stray from it. I also hope that we're right there at the tower, please. Yes, oh, okay. The tower. We got a bit closer, no? A bit. But I'll take that. Ah, this game is so pretty. It's so pretty. I know I keep saying it. I see no sign of those mercenaries. Let's hope it doesn't mean uh, pretty pumped. I overclocked my GPU. Just did a stress test with Destiny. I'm able to stream with my settings on high. Stayed 60 frames the whole time. I'm officially... Heck yeah. Way to go. Did you do that all on your own? Because overclocking can be real, real stressful, by the way. Like, really, really, really stressful. This seems pretty nice. Before the bite. Uh, yes. But way to go on that, Sleazy. Way to go, bud. A vegetable god. Oh, look at that. Hey, what are you doing here? Whoever planted it won't see it grow. Hugo will love it. I'll keep it there. Oh, like that's before. cute. It suits you. Well, thank you. Let's keep going. Uh, what was this door over here? Locked. That's awesome, though, dude. Especially with Destiny. Destiny is like a pretty, pretty chonky game. Box. Yeah, I did download an MSI Afterburner and Com Booster. Nice, nice. Next thing you're gonna tell me is, yeah, I overclocked my CPU. Cause that's also can be a little, little stressy. I wonder how the Count of Provence hopes to deal with this mess. People seem to think he doesn't care much. His army rules for him. Which doesn't prevent those mercenaries from wandering around. And we thought the place was safe. The fact that they're giving me all these supplies, something's about to go down. That's next on the list. See, I knew it. See, great, great beards think alike. I always say. That's awesome, though, dude. Congrats, man. Now the ultimate test is now you got to now you got to run a stream. 
gotta run a stream and see see how it goes with destiny everything uh i have to get a different software because i have a ryzen 5 oh you got a ryzen 5 i thought you had i thought you said you had something else dude ryzen is fucking amazing ryzen is is big big time awesome i love uh amd what they've been doing i did it went smooth oh oh wait you were live what the fuck oh i see the street i see it now i had the notification and i just was zoomed in on this ryzen 5600g Ooh, you got the ryzen uh fifth gen series very very nice yeah ryzen fives are very very good at, um don't know why i can go down here okay well probably bad guys around i was just stress testing not an actual stream i got you man no. we're probably gonna have to come back around that door i'm calling it Gonna find a knife. And dead. <laughs> oh my god. Dude, I got like insta killed. Oh my god. Yeah. Again, for anyone that may just be popping in, uh, I am playing this game on hard, so the hardest difficulty. So yay. Um, because I'm a masochist like that, so yay again. Uh, but yeah, this game is it's good. I, I do like the stealth features in this game. This game is very, very stealthy. I, I It's like a medieval splinter cell. Good comparison. Uh, just stress testing, not an actual stream. Gotcha, gotcha. Oh, he was in that room. That's right, girl. But uh, I'm glad. I'm glad that the stress test went well, by the way, Sleazy. Really, really glad to hear it, bud. You need any help with uh, overclocking? Let me know, because overclocking, it's a lot of like uh, plug and play. I want to say plug and play. Yeah, plug and play. Holy shit, there's so much. Come on. I, I know, I know. We're gonna go this way. Chris is insane. Play this game. Uh it it's difficult. Yeah, right off the bat, it's already difficult, but um You can ask any of our regulars here, Yuri. I'm I'm low-key masochist. I just I I I find playing these games on the hardest difficulty. Um No way. Fuck! Oh, no, shit. No, no. Lucas, why don't you do anything? Lucas is just standing there saying no, 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 no. Lucas! God damn it. Okay, well, at least we know what to expect now. Yes. 
Uh, yeah, I searched Reddit for people that had charts for specs on their overclocking specifically. Yeah, that's a good way to go about it. I'm gonna kill this guy. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Sir, 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 you don't need to come in here. There's no reason. Why did he come in? Well, he didn't have to. He didn't have to come into that room. We must get Max out of the way out before that chief arrives. Come on. That's gotta be you. Oh no. Oh, shit. We've been seen. Okay. But yeah, that's a good that's a good way to kind of find a baseline for overclocking. For sure. Absolutely. Uh is she using a shepherd sling? I don't know. Um, but that is a uh, that is her weapon of choice. She kicks ass with this sling. She's like a crack shot, like. Watch this. You want to see something cool? All right. You win this time. Damn it. So you can actually use the rats. You actually use the rats to your advantage. Especially for these big bulky armor boys. Not sure you're over there. Stay away. Ah, you must be that way. Not this way. Not this way. Well, you can you can hit the torches out of their hands, and then the rats just dominate them. I don't know what this guy's doing. Uh, you know what? We don't have to fight him. We don't have to fight them. Stealth is an option. Well, fighting is an option. Watch, ready? So, you're hiding over there. Uh, uh I guess not. Oh, never mind. That's still slowing us down. We're almost there. Almost. That's gotta be you. Stay away. That's gotta be you. Not this way. Not this way. Whoa, that's a rat tornado. No, no, we were so close. No. <laughs> oh, we were so close. God damn it. I thought we could like slingshot the dude. Um, I thought we could slingshot him and just end him, but I guess not. So that's cool. Or slingshot the torch out of his hand, but I guess that's not an option either. So yay. Uh, all right, we got that one, that one, and that one, and then we'll get that. And made it through. Easy peasy.
first try, right? We're here. I think we're safe now. We better be. Great. What's wrong? Vodanus and we're in here. We did it. Those last months on the road. After all that happened in Guihen. Hugo was always worried that it would start all over again. But everything was so nice and quiet. And so I told him that maybe it was over. That the worst was behind. We all hoped it was. But what are we going to tell him now? That the rats are back? That the bite has killed hundreds? And this new home that he likes. Ah, the audio, the, the music in this game. I'm not ready for this. Spot on. No one could be ready for this. But soon we won't be alone in it anymore. We'll have the best alchemists by our side. I don't know about that. I don't know about. I don't know about Good. that. Good. Now look, a real order lodge. Let's get this Magister Vodan to Hugo. And yeah, those That's rats will. How do we get upstairs? I see no door, but these sorts of iron bells. Look, they bear planet symbols. And here, the sun sits in their center. The order of the planets is not right. How does the whole thing work? There are locks for a key under each bell. It's one big mechanism. But we don't have a key, so... I think the key makes each bell pivot. But your sling may do the trick. Let's try from the left. All right. From left to right, the correct order is Jupiter, Mars, the Sun, Venus, and Mercury. Jupiter's symbol looks like a Z, like for Zeus. Okay, so Z. The last one is Mercury, god of commerce. He carries a staff with two snakes intertwined. Two snakes intertwined. I'm done. Okay, and then oh, so the first. Okay, he said from left to right. Okay, so the first one is Z. No, Z. That's it. Jupiter. Okay. What's next? To Jupiter's right is Mars, the god of war. It's a shield crossed by a spear. A spear, shield. <clears throat> Mars should be a circle with a line going through it. <clears throat> Mars. Done. Now, Venus is the first to the right of the sun. It's shaped like a necklace. circles with a line going down I think this is that's all of them I think yes hey oh, puzzle it's so archaic good work let's go find this magister think about it if we had to solve that without Lucas that would have been very hard mode <laughs> that would have been the that would have been the definition of very hard mode I guarantee he's dead I'm calling it he dead Oh, oh. Magister Voda, I'm Amicia de Rune. A daughter. That explains why those brutes downstairs are so quiet. The Order was quite impressed by the way you put down the Inquisition in Guienne. Well, I didn't have a choice. Not a choice. A calling. That of a carrier's protector. A what? A protector. Your function among the Order. Wait, I'm not. And you are? I'm Lucas. I'm an alchemist too. An apprentice. Does your magistrate know you entitle yourself? Who cares? The macula's woken up again. My brother needs your help. Yeah, I've the never used a slingshot there. before though, Sleazy, so I have no idea. Others are burned in it. Take my bag. Yeah, he's an asshole. Let's go see that carrier. Oh. 
He's a he's a total asshole, Yuri. <laughs> he's like, I do not like him. Magister Verdun. Where is he? It's upstairs. How are you doing? I'm scared. Hugo, this is Magister Verdun. Hello. We should start immediately. I will need silence. Mother. I'll handle it. I hate his hat. <laughs> I don't like his hat at all. Hey! Chapter three done, guys, gals, and pals. There we go. Yeah, seems useless and this seems like an asshole. Right now, coming. I heard you go cry. What's going on? He didn't react well. He's having a seizure. What, mother? You must stop this. We don't know this man. Amicia, this sort of thing was always likely, and this man is an exalted member of the most ancient college of alchemists that exists. The order knows the macula. Hugo is not alone. I'm here. We need nightshade as soon as possible. Seems to like an terminus. asshole. There is a herbalist in the outskirts of the city. It's at the other end of the butcher's district, at the edge of the forest. Do you of see? course. I'm coming. I feel useless here anyway. Uh, they're fun, pretty rewarding once mastered. I can't use a shepherd sling, but I'm pretty decent shot with an overgrip slingshot at about 40 feet. I would love to try a slingshot. That sounds like so much fun. That sounds like so much fun. This is also making me want to really like get back into archery. I, I have a bow. I just need to get new arrows because most of the arrows that I have are like like the um, I forgot what they're called, but the uh, the feathers for the notches. They're they're like all ripped. So I either need to get them re feathered. I forgot the actual term for it, or I just need to get some new arrows <laughs> like real badly. But uh, that's really, really cool. I would consider picking up a sling and trying out like a sling, uh, but that's pretty cool though. 40 feet. Quills. Yeah, I knew that. That's what I said. I was just testing you free and you passed 10 out of 10. You get an A plus free. Way to go. Amicia care about her little brother. Yeah, she does. She's a good sister. Uh, yeah, sling is, yeah, absolutely. Abso sling is an actual weapon. We have a long way to go. Let's not waste time. Also, wait, isn't are getting worse and worse? I know you're worried, but you should give Magister Vodon some time. Time? To do what? Make Hugo feel even worse? He's conducting tests. But he knows what he's doing. Mm. He's the most competent in his domain. I don't oh, trust no, him. He's been treating my brother like an animal. No. We need another solution. Like this island Hugo dreams of. A dream? What can we do with a dream, Amicia? Just keep caring about him, please. I care, but it's not enough anymore. Haha, -ha, you're stuck in the stockade. Oh, I can't go up there and laugh at him, darn. Uh, most definitely it's good for uh, a good, a good, a lethal for small game animals. Yeah. He's gone. Wasn't the sling? I think the sling was developed by I like. I, can't I could be completely wrong about this, but I believe the sling was developed by like shepherds, like that were guarding like flocks of like sheep and like uh, like animals and stuff like that, and they developed it in order to repel like any um, any like predators, like wolves and stuff like that, from coming at them. They would utilize the sling in order to scare them away. I think that is like where the when the sling was like developed. If I'm not mistaken. All right. I don't know. Our gate should be over there. Oh, it stinks. Well, that means we're on the right path. There it is. Mm, yeah, follow the smell. Follow your nose. All right. You ready? Yes. I'm ready. Let's go.
Yes? Wait, yes? What? Like, I was right? Was I right? <laughs> I thought... I wasn't sure. I was, like, 70% sure that that's where the sl Like, when... Like, why the sling was developed. I just don't know when. Uh, I learned a new thing. Sleazy's very smart. Listen to Gandalf or that new wizard from the new Lord of the Rings TV show. Oh, that's definitely Gandalf. Oh, follow the nose. Oh, Dan, I thought I was right. <laughs> it's the shortest way to the herbalist. Oh, right. We're going to the herbalist. Good people. I've got all the poultry you could ever want. Pork, pork, to roast, to boil. Tastiest meat in the world. Looks tasty for sure. Duck or goose. You don't know what you're missing. Guys, this is where the untitled goose game started. It started here in the 1300s. Untitled Goose Game. <laughs> uh, I don't care enough about the origins of the slingshot to Google it for you. You know what? That's okay. I can I can Google it because now I'm very curious. So thank you, Free, for making me get off my ass and do this. I appreciate it. Um, when was the sling developed? Ten thousand BC. The sling was one of the first projectile weapons developed as early as ten thousand BC. Uh, slings played an important role in Persian, Greek, Roman, and various Mesopotamian armies. They were considered to be equal or better than bowmen. Never mind. I was completely, completely wrong. Uh, it's wow, that old. Ten thousand BC. Never mind. I was I was so so wrong. Like a thousand percent wrong. Also, hold on one second. Somebody just ended their stream and I want to make sure that I am supporting friends. So give me one second. I got freckled stream open. I got Sal's stream open. Uh okay. And then who else? Who else is live right now that I can support with the lurky? Let's see. Ba -ba -ba -ba. That's one, that's two, and yeah, you're number three. There we go. Because I like to support other streamers while I'm streaming, and that's it. Three peeps. That's all you can support. <laughs> that's it. All right. Uh, We good? We good? Yep. They're still live? Okay, good. Uh, Nothing against the person who they were rating. I just, I'd rather support somebody that I know. Uh, You know what I mean? Oh, I got to fucking firebot oh, there we go done 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 okay um so it was used to kill people in the beginning after all yep tell as old as time people killing There's people we're not there yet and Hugo might even be getting worse right now oh Let's my hurry. god it will be all right um uh, or this is a place for poor people yeah it does seem kind of like a slum but I think we're near the port oh no Yeah, this is definitely like kind of like a slum. Dad is all alone at home. Go soon, Mum. What's going on? Uh oh. Let us through. What's this? Sling is pretty dangerous, yeah. This district is now closed on the authority of the Count Victor of Arl. For your own safety, do not try to get inside. You can't keep us out. No, Shuko can't wait. There might be another way in. Tell us what's happening. Our children are in there. We know something's going on. What are you hiding from us? Did people die? Where do you want us to go? Hey, there's a back alley through there. What do you think? Do you see a way in? Wait. Uh. I think. Hey, way to go, Lucas. Using his brain. Yeah, but 10,000 BC, a weapon that's been around forever. And I mean, if you think about it, a weapon like a sling, you have like infinite ammo, any rock that you could find on the ground. Yeah, this is definitely going to go well, isn't it? Totally not. Just hold your breath. Totally going to find probably a bunch of mice or rats. Oh, Lucas, no, don't fall in it. It's gross. Don't tell me. Yes. I got something in my mouth. Eh, oh no. Oh no. Oh, Lucas. 
All the living things that must be born from this. Why in the world would you think about that? Uh. It stops me from losing my mind. But it takes me closer to losing mine. Just think of it as matter being transformed. Oh, Lord. <sighs> my boots are ruined. The ground is soaked with blood. Like the arena. Oh, this whole place uh -oh. is just bait. Yep. We're going to see some mices in a second. Some raddies. Yeah, very, very gross, but uh, we're done with that, at least. There's a cart in the way. We have to keep going. Help me with this. Yes. Wait, uh, no! <laughs> what is that? Oh, no. no, not them, not again! We're going to need fire, quick. I knew it. They're already spreading. Now we'll have to go through them again. We can do it. Just stay focused on getting the nightshade. Yes, yes. You hear that? There are still people around. Uh oh. They didn't evacuate the district. It's like in the arena. The fires won't be bright enough to let us cross. Yeah, we're gonna have to, uh. Firebomb this up. They came for the meat. Yeah, well, I mean, they're they're like piranhas, so first they're gonna hit up the butchers, like oh, they need to move. They want that hanging carcass, right? Of course they do. Let's see, sling, regular sling, and a babouche. They can't reach it. That bag. It's like the ones in the cart. Try hitting it with your sling. Oh. It normally preserves meat, but it's thick enough to chop the flames. This is muscle, Peter, right? Yes, a lot of it. If the people outside knew what's happening, they have family here, children. There's no way the army can hide that. It's gonna be chaos, Lucas. Lord, it's infested. Paul, let's leave now! Wait! For light! Townsfolk? I guess. How many are there left? No! Now the fire. We got Saltpeter outside. Yes. Okay, I see. No, thank you, Mises. That's close enough. Come, don't stay there. Wait, I'm taking some. This stuff is too useful. Yeah, that's pretty useful because it's all yours now. I have it. Stay back. We can use this to put out torches. That's it. Let's keep going. Yes, well done. We can use this to put out torches and I guess kill like enemy soul jars. I really hope we find our herbalist in this mess. He's outside the city, right? So maybe he's safe. What do we got in here? Ooh, five pieces. I don't know what that is. Uh, I thought I saw a knife. I guarantee we're going to have to fight enemy soul jars. Three more down here. Yep. They didn't let go easily. A soldier. Hey, what are you doing here? We're just crossing. No one gets out. Those are the orders. Wait, no. You should be dead. He's going to throw. Amicia. Yeah. Asshole. That was so close. Wow. Kill the soldier of the army of Provence. I know. Why did he attack us? Look. They're killing townsfolk. They're, they're purging the districts now. Mm hmm. Yeah. You won't go farther. God, that bite is going faster than us. Oh, God. Oh, no. It's us or them now. You go, go. Wait. We need that nightshade box. I guess you're right. Listen. You can use that salt pitcher against them. Take this to Craftsman Extinguis. It should be. Oh. Extinguis. Ha! 
power of rats. Goodness, well, it worked. We did it in the past, but it's still. Get down, another one. The more dead we have in the streets, the more damn rats we get. Shit. <laughs> Deserves it. Totally, totally deserves it. Keep this bomb down behind. For what, Amicia? A dream of an island. A dream he's been having for weeks. Hmm. The soldiers protecting protecting rights. So why would they kill the residents? Because basically they're looking at this as a um, as a plague. I mean, obviously the, the the name of the game. So they're looking at this as a plague. So when you know, I mean, especially think think about with like COVID, right? With COVID, um, okay. Well, that was dumb. Uh, but with COVID, you know, with quarantine and quarantining and everything like that, that's what they're doing, except on a drastic, drastic scale. So this is basically one big purge of a quarantine. Got it. Heard somebody in the distance screaming. We must leave the city. Keep this bomb down behind. For what, Amicia? A dream of an island. A dream he's been having for weeks. We should just talk to the whole district. Head to the damn story. Whatever made that snap must be close. Oh, I see. Fucking asshole. Stay there, or I'll make you regret I hate that. Okay, I see what we got to do. So we lure the guy down the stairs so that way I don't have to use two saltpeters and then we use the big gold thing and then we go to the thing and the thing. Got it, got it, got it, got it. Okay, I'm on it. I'm on it. I got this. Yeah, it's not going to work. But yeah, they're basically just scorched earth. They're just for what, Amicia? A dream of an island. A dream he's been having for weeks. We should just talk to the whole district. Head to the damn story. What's making that noise? Just tell me that ruined it. Oh no. Yeah, I fucked up. I fucked up. You know what? Rats have... Take me. Take me, rats. Take me. I fucked up again. Okay, so I have to, I have to lure him down there. I gotta lure him down there and then we douse him. Keep this bomb 
down behind. For what, Amicia? A dream of an island. A dream he's been having for weeks. Better be careful. Watch this. Got him. That's what I was trying to do the whole entire time. That's what I was trying to do the whole entire time. got in here what we got in here got uh, a lot of chemicals I improve my gear if I found <gasps> a, workbench. a workbench any news from the count the soldiers nah I already gave the beast full power over the city the beast I explains the carnage the man's a dog of war two torches your job a cloud of extinguish will put out several <laughs> Enough of our time already. Come, they closed the portcullis. There must be a way to open it again. I hope Hugo's holding on. All right. I say it, but he survived worse. This has to stop. Uh, we're going to have a problem. What? Uh, there's no brake on this thing, so we'll have to run. That's it. Release on my go. Go. Coming. Did it? Good work. Look, no rats. So they stopped at the city walls. <sighs> they don't care about walls. They care about food. I don't see any soldiers either. Hey. Oh, Andy's in the room. Hi, Andy. In Bodan's laboratory, th there was a fresco with an island on it. There was. I saw, I saw that too. I seen it. That Bodan must know about it. All right, all right. I'll try to ask. Thank you. Now, Mother said the herbalist lives at the edge of a forest. We should be close. It's so quiet. It feels off. There were people here not too long ago. No blood. No sign of a fight. Where are they? Uh, probably dead. I'm gonna say probably dead or they ran away. Someone used that forge recently. Uh, hey, there's a workbench here. Oh, <gasps> prove your gear with it. You should take a look right now. Uh, I will. Let me grab right. some stuff over here. And what can I improve? Now I, I don't think there was workbenches in the first one. Oh, cool. Okay. So, um, I can only improve one thing right now, it looks like. So, um, breaking helpful tool for breaking jars knife pyrites and bolts into pieces that she has no more uh has no more room uh we can softening the cords can make less noise when she uses the sling sewing new pockets on her gear will let her carry more ammo here a new ring on her belt will help her carry additional jars uh let's do let's do the sling i feel like the sling is a good start and now I don't have any more tools. So, but that's better. That'll help. Cool. Cool, 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 cool. Okay. All right. Before we continue, I'm going to take a quick potty break, like really, really quick. I just need to run to the bathroom. So give me like uh, two minutes, go. guys, gals, and yes. pals. Let's go. Uh, I'm going to run to the bathroom really, really quick. And once I get back, we're going to continue with this. We can still got about like little like two hours before the stream is going to be over so i will be pee -pee right time. back yes quick pp pee -pee time i will be right back in uh two minutes and uh let's see what happened in this village i'll be right back
That's right, Beardy. You know that I'm coming back. You know me all too well. Get out of here, you adorable little beard, you. All right, uh, I am back, guys, gals, and pals. Um, hold on, there's one thing I gotta check. I think I see a bot account in the chat um, because there are bots all over Twitch, and some are not good bots. So let me check out and see if this account is indeed a bot account. Um, I don't, I don't recognize that account. I think that is a bot account. Uh. Yeah, I'm just going to go ahead and ban that account real quick. There I go. Okay. Wielding the ban hammer like a professional. All right. Uh, we're going to go ahead and continue with this. I'm having a lot of fun with this game. I hope you guys, gals, and pals are enjoying this game. Uh, so far, story is like fantastic so far. I'm really, really enjoying this. Uh, so let's go ahead and continue. Uh, I want to see what's downstairs. What's downstairs in this, in this place? Oh, there's a body here. Oh, Rats. bodies. No. Stabbed. Probably soldiers. Where do I find another knife? I would really like another knife. I have not found a single knife. Come on. Ah, rats. I told you. No wall can stop them. It's those carcasses. Yes, they keep following the blood. But we don't know where the blood stops. Well, there's only one way to find out. I'm assuming that house over there seems to be the way. I'm going to tap out for the night, but I hope you have a good one and see you tomorrow. Okay, Leo, take care. Might be making a big announcement tomorrow, uh, which I'm very excited for. Hey, gang. Hey, Whoa. Let's get some big hype in the chat. We forgot you. Well, I'll fix that. Oh God! Oh, <laughs> I got stuck on a wall. Uh, hey, normal. How are you doing, buddy? What's going on? Well, come on in, normal. Come on. They're here. Why is it always gotta be rats? Yeah. No wolf can stop us. It's always rats. Yes. How's it going though, normal? How you doing, bud? How's your Monday going? I hope everybody's having a great Monday. Hey! No, watch out! Get out of here. I didn't expect that. Oh, that damn bastard. I'm afraid we're not done with them. This has to end. Can I make any more of that? I can't make any more of that. I only got one more extinguisher. Oh great. Uh, things might do have been good. Might have to dip tonight, though, because I'm actually terrified of rats. Oh, I totally understand, man. I gave the PSA warning in the beginning of the stream. I was like, hey, if anybody doesn't like rats, uh, then this might not be the game for you. Uh, but I totally don't blame you because rats are gross. But I totally understand if you got to go, man, because of the the wreaths. Uh, but I'm glad to hear that you're doing well, Normal. Glad to hear that you're doing well. Where does this stop? The beast is taking action. We need that now. All the men will panic. I know. Does it all we got be right? Hmm. I need like a stick or something over here. Salt Peter over there. Go back this way. Uh, I wanted to play it so bad, but I'm already getting those cold chills. Have a good night, dude. I'll pop in tomorrow. Okay, sounds good, normal. 
Take care, buddy. And I uh, hope you have a good night, man. Hope you have a good night. Make sure to go say hi to Freckled because he is also streaming. I don't have anything. What is he doing? He's just crouched. Uh, saw a video where someone got a deep fried rat from Popeyes and she was like, don't buy Popeyes, y'all. It was shocking and sad specifically this week because apparently if you buy a sandwich, you get another free one. That's all they know. Um, gonna say this, Leo. I don't know if I believe that that sounds like a publicity stunt or like a stage sort of video. A lot of those kind of videos usually are. Um, or just someone who's disgruntled against like Popeyes and stuff. I, I don't believe that that would happen. Uh, but if it did, ew, gross. Oh, no, 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 no. How do I, how do I get through here? How am I going to get through here? But it's, it sounds like a publicity stunt. To me, at least. Every restaurant has something like that happen. Many have been proven to be fake, but it does happen. It's extremely rare there. Get a, get a sandwich. You'll be fine. Yeah. Yeah. That sounds like someone staged that to make Popeyes look bad or just to... Um, you know what I mean? That's how it sounds to me, at least. I want Popeyes in the... I could go for some Popeyes right now. Listen, also, here's the thing. If you were to, like, you know, open a bag of Popeyes and then there's just a deep fried rat in there, you know what you do? Story of my life you you said take it. Wa. You go bring it over to the trash can and you put it in or you take pictures of it and then reach out to Popeyes and be like, what the fuck is this? So... Um, you know, problem solved. <laughs> uh, thank you, babe. Thank you for the Wawa. Appreciate it. What are you doing now, baby? I saw I saw you looking at Destiny. Are you going to play Destiny? I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing here. Like, where am I supposed to be going? I feel like I'm supposed to go down there, but I will not make it there. Maybe that fire over there. Yeah, I'm going to say that fire over there. Ah, yeah. Yeah, this was right. This feels right. I can't come to you. No, Lucas. God damn it, Lucas. Ah. Uh... Did you hear Lucas? Lucas was like, ah! <laughs> okay. Get fucked. God damn it, rats. That's the guy. I was playing it hours ago, but kept losing connection to servers, so I quit. Yeah, it's like the last day before the reset. Um, so probably a lot of people just like trying to jump on, you know.
Oh! Oh! God! Oh! She took him right in the side! Oh! That's gotta hurt! Oh! Uh, hey, other Chris! Hey, Chris! How are you doing? Welcome on in! How's it going? How's your morning going so far? But yeah, the servers are probably trash right now. I don't... Is it always got to be rats? Why you always got to die? Uh, well, that was dumb. <laughs> that was that was dumb. It worked last time. Why didn't it work that time? Can you stay right there, you hear? <laughs> What's this sound? Why are they all? There's a lot more rats here than last time. Oh, well, Lucas is immortal to rats. That's good to know. I am also out of jars. No, 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 I'm almost there. Why did it work last time? Why did it work last time? Last time it worked. I was able just to run on through. happening what am i to do no come on there was like two rats on there was like two rats on me what is going on uh it's going all right just gearing up for work uh more work gotcha gotcha well i hope work goes well today for you Fucking rats, am I right? Thank you. Thank you, Chris. Kill me. Why does it work? Oh, I don't get it sometimes. I really, really don't get it sometimes. Thank you, Francis, for the KO. Appreciate it, bud. No, I... Why did it work the one time or those two times and now not these times? I don't get it. Supposed to do that. No. Uh, 
Well, am I have a, did I fuck up? I feel like they're not supposed to do that. Oh my god, what am I doing wrong? I'm restarting this section. I'm I I, I must have done something wrong. I must have done something wrong. He's taking action. We need that now, or... Or the men will panic. I know. Oh, I don't have to use all my stuff and everything. Watch this. That sound. Go check. Be more careful. I'm careful enough. Yeah, I'm careful enough. We got him. We got him. Really would love one of those torches. Would love for them to drop one of those torches. Wasn't there a stick or something around here? <gasps> Look at that. Oh my god. It saved me so much time. <gasps> Watch this. Are you ready for this? So you do that. Oh, see, all I needed was a moment to just realign and figure my shit out. Yay. Thank you, Francis. This reminds me of Rat Jam Emo. Yeah, I mean, this is where Rat Jam Emo came came from. You know, it's a tale as old as time. Let's see what's in this building. Please give me stuff. I need stuff. Lucas, 
It's over. Not yet. I know what it looks like. We can still do this. We just need to find the herbalist shop. Just try to calm down. You won't make it in that state. What was that? How can I? These dogs are only making you go suffering Forget worse. It. Well, the herbalist is dead. Oh, what's the matter? Don't like the light. Yep, uh, he dead. He the big D A D A D A D A D A D A D A D. Uh. Like we can get over there. Meet with swords. I like that. Got a cat. That that sounds like a a band. Great, I hit the counter, but I forgot you don't hit it. You have to hold it to, in order to counter them. Whoopsie. Yeah, I wish you could get a bite of me, eh? Mm-hmm. Well, I know I'm gonna get a bite of you, sir. Not right now, though. Wait for him to come back, and then I'm gonna have these rats just demolish him. They're just gonna rip him to shreds. Here it comes. Eat this. Oh, Ash. Hey, Ash is here, everybody. We haven't seen Ash in a while. Put him on my shoulder, like put a little, a little paw. Ash is, uh, yeah, cat. Ash is here. It's, it's, oh, there he is. Look. He's like, Papa, you get two paws, two paws on your shoulder, Papa. That is all the love that I am able to give you. Yeah, he's having a little bit of a <laughs> virtual pets. Yeah, he's having a little bit of a rough time. Um, he comes down here to hang out and obviously, like, go potty and stuff like that and everything. But Indy, Indy and him, they get, they get along. The problem is, is that Indy's a dog and he's a puppy and he wants to be like all up and oh my God, there are paws underneath the fucking door. Indy is trying to like, <laughs> all, all you see underneath my door to the office here is just two like little tips of paws because he just wants in. He's like, I know the cat is in here. You ready, Ash? Easy. Ash did a leaping hiss. Oh, it's okay. It's okay. Oh, they're fighting. Here, you guys want to see some some cat on cat on dog action? Ash is here. I'll switch the cameras. Ash is trying to figure out a way to get past Indy. Easy. And he got away. He got away. He's like, this time you got away, you you rotten cat, you. How dare. Get out. Fuck you. Yeah. So, like, they, they get along. They get along. It's just that Indy wants to be, like, up in, in Ash's face. And Ash doesn't want anything about that. Ash is like, no, thank you. Um, but Ash is starting to learn, like, how to hiss and how to tell uh, Indy, basically, like, no, get fucked. Like, please stop and everything. So... I'm glad that like Ash is like defending himself because Ash for the longest time didn't really know how to like hiss or or anything like that. He used to just kind of blow air. It was more like a like like that kind of thing <laughs> instead of hissing. But uh, since Indy has, uh, you know, come into our family, Ash now knows how to hiss. 
He knows how to defend himself. He's been uh, standing up for himself and everything. And so I'm proud of him. I'm proud of him. I just wish that they would just get along and everything and not have any of this happen and everything. You know what I mean? Uh, all right. Someone, someone's stream just went offline. So I was just opening up somebody else's stream. So there we go. Uh, and he is still pretty much a baby, right? Yeah, he's only about like nine months, eight, nine months old. So he's still very much a baby. Um, you know, it's going to take a while. He's not, even, he's also not neutered. He's also not neutered. So, uh, a lot of times, uh, sorry, I just realized my dust cover wasn't on my other camera. Um, you know, a lot of times, um, you know, especially dogs, they get very, very hyper and everything. Um, before they get neutered and everything. So I'm sure once he gets neutered, uh, we're going to notice a dramatic change and notice him be a little bit more uh, like mellow and everything. So, but he is very, very much a puppy. Nice. Oh, I got a tool. Blinded by the loud. Get the fuck out of here, rats, you son of a bitch. Blinded by the boot. Uh, now we can check this chest because all the dudes. Oh my god, is that all rats over there? Do you guys see that? That's so many fucking rats. All right, so now that we got this path. That's all they know. The soldiers, they're just meat with swords. Meat with swords. She is uh, getting a little dark there with those, those kind of comments. Uh, but now that we got this path, we can do this. And we can go ahead and light this stick up and we can go see what this is about. But yeah, he's a puppy, so we can't even really be like mad at him. You know, he's just a puppy. Just a little puppy. All right, we made it oh, through. It. Oh, or not. It's an angel wall. There might be another way. Yes, let's look. Okay, never mind. <laughs> I got I got a little tilted there for a hot second because I was like, fuck the door. It's date night time. Awesome stream, Chris. Have a great evening. Hey, Minion, thank you so much for coming in and hanging out with us, bud. I really, really do appreciate it. Um, thank you again so much, by the way, Minion. I hope you have a wonderful, wonderful date night and a uh, wonderful rest of your Monday. And uh, I, ho I hope you just take care, bud. Take care and be well. Lucas, tell me, tell me it's here. We're at the herbalist, but we'll have to look. So what does Nightshade look like? Look for a purple flower in the shape of a star. Purple star, purple star. Is this it? Oh, no, not the right shape. It's all right. Just keep looking. Well, I'm having a I'm having a caramel candy because I'm craving the chocolate. Hmm. Okay. No flowers here. Oh, Lord, focus, focus. Hey, we're here now. It's all right. Hmm. Gonna climb this. Oh, nothing. Oh no. The herbalist wife. They killed Oh no, she was so nice to us in the beginning of the game. She gave us compliments. Assholes.
things that could happen to us. I'm missing one. Hmm. Francis, it's like you're playing the game with us. Your tea is featured in the game. <laughs> is this it? Afraid compliments uh, oh, is not right. strong enough uh, armor. That's true. Lucas. I know. Let's check the house. I was gonna say inside the fucking be... house. The tea fights the the the. The best offense is tea. God, Lindos. Oh, you must be joking. It's all junk. No, wait. And now I'm not even there for him. How will we even get back? <sighs> Hands are sweaty. Look for anybody hiding. Knees Please weak. Come look. Sorry, I was chewing. Soldiers, you should see for yourself. Time, so let's make it count. Cutscene. You stay here in control. Report if you see one bloody rat. The others with me. Look for any valuables. We need food, drugs, any goods. They're going in. Downtown so Abbey movie? Uh, Downtown Abbey has a movie? What? You're not all right. I am. No, you're not. You're not even breathing right now. She's having a panic attack. I'm dizzy. My heart's pounding. Downtown Abbey has two movies. See, I do not know that because I do not watch Downtown Abbey. Listen, the Count soldiers are going to seize everything. We've got to get the... Where have I been not watching Downtown Abbey? I have to. No. You're in no state to do this. I'm going. I'll sneak in. I can do it. Pronouncing it wrong, too? I, I mean, shows how much I watched Downtown Abbey. <laughs> oh, down 10, not downtown. Oh. Well, again, shows how much I watched Downtown App. <laughs> I didn't know that that's how it was pronounced. I always thought it was Downtown Abbey. I was interested. My 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 grandmother on my dad's side used to watch a lot of Downtown Abbey. Like a lot of it. Oh no, Lucas! Watched anything much recently? All I did was finish Vikings. Vikings, I started. I have to. I'm gonna have to eventually finish it. So. Hey, rats are gonna pop up. Hiding, are we? I'll still find you. Hiding, are we? I'm a knight in armor. Oh, that guy, I can kill. Hey. 
Ah, uh, this guy. He's dead. I'll get the bastard who did this. Making my way down to uh, down tin, walking fast, faces pass, and I'm downtown. <laughs> Shouldn't, shouldn't have told me that it was the wrong thing. I'm just going to keep saying it the wrong way. <laughs> it's called conditioning. Years of saying something the complete wrong way and then oh, finding... It. It's... <laughs> it's my brain. It's how my brain works. That's it. That's the way to do it. Mm-hmm. Bloody hell. I swear I'll find a murderer. Can you say nay as in the knights that you... Oh, nee. We are the knights who say nee. nee. Wait a second. That way. I'm <laughs> Oh. Oh, oh, oh. Hang in there, Lucas. I'm here. I'll make them pay. Someone killed him. Oh my god. Oh my god. They were gonna go killed him. Please be alive, please. Hope Lucas is alive. Is it an A? It's me. There is one word. Did they hurt you? So I've. I think it's knee. It's the, uh, there is one word that knights who say knee cannot hear. What word is it? No, you say it. No, now I said it. <laughs> God, I love Monty Python's Quest for the Holy Grail. Such a good, good movie. I found the nightshade. We have to go now. They're coming. Go hide. I'll handle them. No, we got what we need. Let's leave now. No, they'll come after us, and I'm done running away. Man down! We've got an intruder here. Alert! That's it. Come. I'm right here. Oh! <laughs> traded shots. We traded. Traded. Like a Call of Duty match. We traded. <laughs> Yo, she is like, she's having like a boy, like, uh, God of War moment where she's just like going berserk. Bring me a shrubbery. So wait, what's the story so far? Um, so I'm going to try my best because I forget what happens in one, but basically the premise is that her brother Hugo has some sort of disease, but it's also some sort of like 
like mystical thing that he's carrying that summons this plague with like the rats and everything so it's flared up again and there's this secret ancient order that supposedly knows how to like take care of it and get rid of it or or something like that um so um they have found this order but the plague has resurfaced and everything and um yeah that's basically the premise uh we're, we're trying to figure out how to stop this from happening and save our younger brother right now he's not feeling good and we need nightshades so we went to this herbalist outside of town and um all this shit is starting to happen so uh hello rich how are you doing this is some david and goliath shit yeah it absolutely is Rich loves games. One said water. Water, Rich, give me one second. I'm having a breakdown in the game. I'll give you what you want. He has a shield. Careful. Intruder here. She's on. Shoot the bags, Mason. It'll blind them. Oh, yes. Yes. How'd you like that, huh? When someone fights, fight. They're too many. They'll keep coming if we don't go. Oh, God. <laughs> It's so weird because you can't really tell which way they're throwing it. So there's like a right way to dodge and then there's not a right way to dodge. And I did not know the right way to dodge. So I died. Doing good. That's good to hear, Rich. I'm glad that you're doing good. And like I always like to say, doing good is always better than not doing good. So. All right. Let's try that again. <laughs> See what I mean? No, oh, see, they're nothing, nothing to be scared of. I miss you. What are you doing? We have to go. No. She's we rampaging. She's way. obviously rampaging. I'll them that it's over. You. Come, I'll give you what you want. He has a shield. Careful. Intruder here. She's on. Shoot the bags, miss. It'll blind them. Ah. Yes, yes. Ah. How'd you like that, huh? When someone fights, fight. They're too many. They'll keep coming if you don't ah! go if you want. This is my ground now. This is where they die. Ah! Ah! Yeah! You're dead. Oh, yes. Come then. Show me how you'll do it. That's all you've got. Come on. You have ah! to stop. Look, dive in. Bro, you're just scared. You have to drive fear into them. Yes. Oh, fucking A. Hey, it's Amen. so fucking hard. God damn it. Ah, oh, so difficult. God damn. Uh, hey, Rich, doing good. Uh, I appreciate the big, mad, bloodthirsty female. Yeah, this game, honestly, I love Amicia. She is a great character. She is a loving sister to Hugo. Hugo's her younger brother who has this, like, ailment, this thing that's causing these rats to, to pop up and everything. Um, but she is a great female protagonist, like, especially in the last game, she starts the game off as like this frightened teenager. And by the end of the game, she is this raging woman who was like, fuck you, you fucking assholes. Get the fuck away from my brother. I am going to kick your ass. Um, and she does indeed kick a lot of ass in the last game that I remember that I remember. Uh, hey, Chris, have you ever played Horizon Zero Dawn or the new one? I have played Horizon Zero Dawn. We did play it, stream it, and we also did play the DLC. Um, I have no way of playing the new one because the new one is only on PlayStation. Unfortunately, I can't play it because I do not own a PlayStation. Uh, but if it ever comes out on PC, I absolutely will. I've heard great things about the new Horizon game. I heard that it's very, very good. Um, it reminds me of the other game I really like. Hell, oh, Hellblade. So, Soena Hellblade. Yes, they are supposed to be coming out with a second one. I don't know when that's coming out. Uh, you fight gods. Yes, Hellblade. Uh, Hellblade. Soena's Soena's so not Soena's sacrifice. Yes, thanks, Bay. Uh, God, Hellblade fucking got me, man. Yeah, it was such a good, good game. I just want to know when we're getting Hellblade two. When the heck are we getting it? Um. I actually was into that game until my PS4 went bad. It's such a good game and I love... Yeah, I don't know how to pronounce her name, by the way. Is it Soena? Soena? 
Uh, Chris, notice you're not dual streaming because Freckled is playing Marvel Spider-Man Remastered. Uh, yeah, because Monday is our, our single player day um, here in the Beard Zone. So we play single player slash interactive games. And um, yeah, that's 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 what we're doing today. That's what we usually do on Mondays. Although like I think like two Mondays ago, two Mondays ago, we did some co op stuff because that was it was the uh, last day of Spooktober. So we played some stuff with Freckled, but that's that's why we're we're playing this right now. Mondays is single player slash interactive day. Uh, and he plus all plus also he wanted to play Spider Man. So, uh, Sanua Sanua, they stop mocking me. Oh my god! <laughs> all right, let's try this again. Let's try this again. Rampage time with rocks. Man down! We've got an intruder here. Oh! That's it. Come, I'm right here. I like how she's just like. There you go whispering to herself like yeah come at me bro yeah. fuck again oh my god <sighs> part is hard i also am playing on the hardest difficulty by the way so man down we've got an intruder here alert that's it come on. i'm right here there you go oh, see they're nothing nothing to be scared of let me see what are you doing we have to go no I'm tired of being afraid. I'll show them that it's over. Come, I'll give you what you want. He has a shield. Shoot them back. It'll blind them. Yes, yes. How would you like that? When someone fights back. There are too many. They'll keep coming. Go if you want. This is my ground now. This is where they die. Fucking oh my. Mm, it's just like if I'm like wondering, like, do I run? Do I like instead of like standing my ground and like shooting, do I run and hide and then bide my time and take my shot? Or do I just stand my ground and just keep on fighting? Like, I'm like, what do I do? What do I do? You know? Uh, Chris out here getting shafted. <laughs> yeah, we're just getting destroyed right now. This sucks. Maybe hide behind a pillar until they miss. Yeah, it's just once you go into aiming mode, you are you are in aiming mode. Like, that is it. You, you are in aiming mode until you stop aiming and then you can then run freely and like faster and everything. So, uh, I'm getting like really like a little low-key frustrated. Uh, you have like one and a half second before they fling their spear once they pick it up. Run in circles. I mean, that's also another good idea. Man down. We've got an intruder here. Yeah, it's like literally you get like one second for the wind up. There you go. My finger also was really sweaty on that. Like this guy. Also, I'm noticing if I can't get a full charge on the slingshot, then uh, it like stuns them. Come, I'll give you what you want. He has a shield. Ah. 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 <gasps> yeah, that's right. Go if you want. This is my ground now. This is where they die. Ah. Oh yes, come then. Show me how you'll do it. That's all you've got. Come on! Ah. Fuck! Oh, I was doing so good. I even killed him. Killed the guy up on the, the 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 catwalk before he even jumped down without doing the fucking bag Man thing. Down. We've got an intruder here. Alert! That's it. Come. I'm right here. There you go. You see that? I was so good. He got see, nothing, my slingshot so powerful so that the guy froze in midair. No, I'm tired of being afraid. I'll show them that it's over. Come. I'll give you what you want. Yeah, shield. Careful. Enough. How'd you like that? Look at that. When someone tried to fight. There's too many. They'll keep coming if you yeah. go. Go if you want. This is my ground now. This is where they die. Ah. Ah, come ah. Oh, yes. Come then. Show me how you'll do it. That's what you've got. Come on. You ah. have to die here. You're just scared. You have to drive fear into them. Yes, follow me. Good talk. Oh. Oh. Jesus, I can't play in a grown-up. Yeah, just a few. 
Oh no! God, I should have ran. I should have ran. I should have ran. Right? I should have ran at that point. That's when I should have run. When I didn't get the shot off. But I think it's better if I, if I get a shot off and stun them and then I can wind up for a better attack. Why are my hands so sweaty right now? Isn't this game a sequel? It is. The first game is called Plague Tale Innocence, and this is called Plague Tale Requiem. How do you like that, huh? When someone fights back, there are too many. No! if we don't go. Go if you want. This is my ground now. This is where they die. Yeah! So yes, so there is a melee, but a lot of it is reactive melee. Like I didn't get any kind of indication. You can, you basically, you can, you can come up behind them and do like stealth moves on enemies. If you have a knife, um, basic, it, you know what it kind of reminds me of? The knife mechanic kind of reminds me of The Last of Us where you have like a shank and if you use it, it breaks. So there's that mechanic. Um, you can, you can. Man down! We've got an intruder here! There you go. No. See, they're nothing, nothing to be scared of. I mean, no. Yeah. So it looks like I can do like a pre wind up or like a early, early off shot. Come, I'll give you what you want. He has a shot. Careful. Intruder. Shoot the bastards. It'll blind them. No. I fucked up there. Yes. Yes. Now what if I move? When someone fights back, there are too many. They'll keep coming if you don't go. Go if you want. This is my ground now. This is where they die. Oh yes, come then. Show me how you'll do it. That's all you've got. Come on! You have to stop. We'll die. Run! You're just scared. You have to drive straight after them. Yes, follow me. Page over. <laughs> this girl definitely isn't innocent, or is this girl innocent? Well, I mean, I think that was the premise of the first one that they went from these like scared kids to quick death after what you've done. This Would man's name is the beast. Spend a bit of time with you before you hang. This man's name is the beast. You should sit down. Oh, so that's all you have Looks to say. Like somebody needs a stretch. A stretch, I will. After this cutscene. You can do better than that. You but uh, that was the premise of the first really game that they they went stop. through their innocence no. as kids, and now. Do you see the situation we're in? Here they are. Supposed to get herbs. How do you think Hugo feels right now without them? How will he feel when his sister is? I hanging? made a mistake, right? I don't know what's happening to me, Lucas. I I feel my mind going. Yes. He's a Dark Souls character, essentially. And it keeps hurting. And you want to hurt it back. But it's a fight you cannot win, Amicia. You are not them. You are at the room. 
That's her last name. Check that posture. That's her last name. Posture check? Sure. Oh, the beast has a flail. Oh, that's great. That's us. Or mace? No, flail. That's a flail. This thing works with fire. I'll tell you when I'm ready. Get out. Your noose is awaiting. Okay, let me do my stretch really, really quick. Hang on one second. I'm just going to do a quick stretch. Uh, all right, and I'll sit up in my seat. So that's two birds, one stone, a stretchy, and a uh, posture check. So thank you, Rich, and thank you, Chris, for the stretchy and the posture check. Got to get that stretch in after that. Yeah, that fight was annoying. That was that was low key, really, really annoying. <laughs> but you know, I'm proud of her. I'm proud of her. She was literally having a a mental breakdown. She was literally having a mental breakdown and like an anxiety attack. And I can relate with that on so many freaking levels. Um, I think what we'll do is let's let's finish out this chapter and then we'll probably call it here, even if it means that we end the stream like a little bit early. But I would at least like to finish off this chapter, chapter three, because I think we're getting pretty close. But I can guarantee this man, the beast, he's probably going to be a boss that we're going to have to fight. I'm calling it already. Uh, but let's go ahead. Yeah, he does look like a Dark Souls character. We'll wait for the executioner. He must be finishing one right now. It's a flashbang. Holy shit. Sort of. Come. Holy shit. This is really not safe at all. Shh, calm down. Come. Okay. It's the only way out of here. Are you joking? No. Just stick to the wall. Oh, this is this I would be I don't have a thing with heights, but man oh man, I would be panicking. Sorry to put you through this. You saved us, Lucas, tiny child. Yeah, yeah, get on with it. Whatever. Please. Yeah, I agree. Let's 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 get the fuck out of here. God, I can't do anything. Let's pass it quietly. I mean, there's bows, there's swords, girl. You could grab any of those weapons. I don't know why, but this character reminds me of the lady in Assassin's Creed. You mean the main character? But the beast got her. We've got enough meat to hold out for a week. Nice work. Get to the depot fast. The girl is to be hanged soon. There'll be quite a crowd. I'll be there. Count on that. That can't be easier. The nightshade might be in it. Maybe you'll sleep too. Oh, we can't take the risk. Hugo needs us. We'll do without. It's my nice god. In Bahala, yeah, I think. Oh, yeah, her hair for sure, absolutely. Oh, he won't move, but there's a fire. Do you still have some of your Lucas uses to fetch you? Will do. Get ready quickly. We don't have much time. Like looking everywhere for my sling. I need my weapon. I need my weapon. Yes. Let's go back to our house. 
saying people won't panic, but a riot? They want to flee the city. The problem will be when they realize. Do you know where I'm going? No, just pushing forward. Hey, are you finished, by the way? Under the table. Quick. Oh, no. Oh, oh. in the depot. I'll be doing just that for two days. Let me take my break, goddammit. Eivor, 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 yes, yes, yes. Ooh. Yeah, may, who knows? Maybe this is young Eivor in another universe. I don't know. But uh, this is also 1300 France. So I don't think it is. Hey, that's the main gate down there. It's so close. We need to find a way down. Can't wait, wait to be back home. I was, I so furious. always just I jumped on down. Always could just jump on down. Here, all the way down. Oh, Lucas, I think we found that depot. Really? Yes, you're right. So that means the nightshade should be somewhere here. <gasps> oh, sling too. All right. You look for the nightshade. I'll look for my sling. We may need it. Right. Nightshade. I hope it's still in my pouch. I was gonna say. She was willing just to like give up her sling. Weapons, swords, knives. Oh, no sling. Let's try somewhere else. Let's pray no one comes in. Or with. No. Don't say that word. Yes. <laughs> try plants, powders. Keep looking. Yeah, it's probably somewhere like out in the open because they just took it from her. Uh, what do we got over here? Maybe here? Please. Where did they put it? Oh, it has to be somewhere. Gotta be around here. Gotta find Maybe my here? shit. No. Looks locked. Later. Maybe with a knife? Hmm. Oh, here you are. I've got it. Careful with that, all right? I know. That smell. That's... Yes. I've got the nice shade, Amicia. Finally. This hasn't been for nothing. Oh! Damn. What was that? I broke a knife. But it was worth it. Plenty of things in here. I should keep an eye out. There could be more of those chests. Ooh, we can get a new upgrade. Uh, we'll hope that we should carry additional ammo. Uh, we'll carry additional jar and breaking knives, jar, pirates, and bolts into pieces. Bolts. Do we get a, do we get a bow? Are we going to get a bow? Is that a thing that we're going to get? Oh my God. I think that is a thing that we're going to get. Okay. It said bolts and that's a thing that I don't have yet. I can do another upgrade. All right, let's get to work. Uh... Cannot. Simply cannot upgrade. Um, I did see a thing over this way. Oh, that. Let's go see what this is. Ooh, is this a secret? This is a secret. Wait, I know this. Lucas, they have a map of Guyenne. Really? What's it doing here? I don't know. Here's the ocean, the lake. Home was. This is this. This is a map of where the first game took place. Yes. It's all in the past. Yeah, that's a Guyen is the uh the area where the first game took place. So that's why she was like so like shocked. Uh and if I remember like beginning of the first game, her house her home literally gets like attacked by the Inquisition. They literally like burn her house down to the ground. 
Um, yeah, the first game was very, very good. And this this is definitely a, a big, big improvement. Uh... Uh, Chris, I said before that a sling, uh, that sling is a sling David would be proud of from David and Goliath. Yeah, no, absolutely. Absolutely. And she's like a cracked shot, too, on top of everything else. But you're absolutely right. This sling is doing work. So, God. how long before we go? Don't know, don't care. You don't want to go out there, believe me. Damn, the gate is right there. There are too many. We can't sneak past them. And we can't stay either. Oh, we need a plan. I don't know. This place is full of things. Let's take a look around. Of course. You see what I see? What? Up there. The ballista. Listen. I've gathered enough materials here to make a large quantity of stupefaccio. So we stick the paste to the tip of the bolt, shoot it, and hopefully the friction from the impact will light it up. And we'll get enough smoke to blind them all. If it works. We don't have any better ideas. Let's get that ballista down. There's a crank up there. How can we climb up? I don't see anything. There has to be something. Hey, go fetch four men. We're doubling the head count on patrol. We must hurry. There'll be even more soon. Well, I don't know. This place is a mess. There could be... There. I found a cart. Yes, well done. Let's get that in place. Okay. Uh, I tried using a sling once. Right. Oh, underneath? Ah, ha, ha, ha. There we go. Uh, I tried using a sling once when I was on tour in Aussie. They had slings and whips for us to try out. I could use neither. Spin and let go one of the ends. Okay, let's go. Uh, let go of both sling and pebble. Go flying into the distance. And I just kept hitting myself with the whip. Yeah. Um, like you think in, in practice, right? That like a sling or a whip would be very, very easy to use, right? Like whip, it's just like, but there's a whole art form and like process in order to utilize it and everything that you got to do it's like easier easier said than done right you handle it right away down we go it's please don't fall yes the chain's cut you can let go good let's get it to the door quick this is a genius plan. It's not going to blow a giant hole. This isn't going to blow a giant hole. I know. If we fail, Hugo will be alone and... And we'll die. And we don't want that. Let's stop here. Wait. The stupefaccio. This is crazy, Lucas. <laughs> this is really crazy. All right. Look how tiny he is compared to this. <laughs> I think the crank on the side arms it. I'm on it. So, when do you open the doors? I won't. Shoot through it. We need friction to get the reaction. What? But we don't even know if it will go through. Too late for that. Get ready. I am. Lucas, you genius, boy genius right there, that Lucas. Were there also giant spiders there or scorpions or snakes? I feel like whips are essentially one of the things that are super multi-purpose and utility and weapon. That is true. They are. But we have everything. We shall give this to him. Yes, we've lost enough time already. How is he? Exhausted. He fell asleep when it calmed down. Please He's fine. Him. He's in good hands. The best you can be sure. Fuck you, Vaden. So, for your sake. Huh. Hey, what's going on, Rufio? How you doing, buddy? Welcome on in. And we did it. Chapter three done. Uh, but not while touring population sites and such. Only times you run into dangerous creatures if you live there or if you go into the outback. True. 
Uh, oh my god, Playtail can't watch the spoilers. I'll lurk. All right, sounds good, Rufio. Totally understand, man. You take care, buddy. Hope you're doing well. Two days. How can you stand there and do nothing? He doesn't deserve this. I'm taking him out of this. Harry reaching the last threshold is a very rare event, a critical one. Of course, from now on, we need to isolate him. The Order has special buildings. You want to lock him away? Do you know what your brother is capable of? He will do much worse. Hey! He's a child! This is not his fault! And the more you hurt him, the more rats are out there, and the more people die! This is why we need to take him away. His power will grow stronger as his days draw shorter. Magister, please. What? what do you mean? Amicia... Hugo is condemned. The last threshold means the death of the carrier. No. There must be a way. Lucas Your managed... friend bought you time when your brother reached the first threshold. But this is something else. There is no stopping it. No elixir, no potion. Wait. There's an island. He keeps talking about an island. Maybe the macula is behind it. It is we a need... child fantasy. So what's a child's fantasy doing on the wall of your laboratory? Yes. What's out there? Poor girl. You're running away from reality. You must accept your brother's fate and your own. And the fate of a protector is to do as the order commands. I don't give a damn about your order. I don't know you. I don't work for you. Let me see him. Hugo is tired, Amicia. You can't enter his room in your state. Let me pass. Not until you've calmed down. You said it yourself. The macula feeds on his emotion. Damn, she is she is like rage. The order's quarters in Marseille as soon as possible. I've got a boat and a man, Joseph, waiting at the harbor. He needs to be warned. As for me, I'm going to rest. Of course, yeah. When you're ready to go. Of course, you're gonna go rest. I'm gonna go rest. Lucas, please go to the harbor and find this Joseph. Yes, Magistra. To stab Lord Red Hat and get it over with. Yeah, he's a fucking asshole. We also we also rescued him too. Rescued him, saved him, and he's still a fucking asshole. <laughs> uh, wow, Amishi is mad. She is. Welcome back, Yuri. How are you doing? Welcome on back. Are you all right? No. Did you know about Hugo? I I wanted to tell you, but. You should have. We're talking about my brother, Lucas. I didn't know Magister Bodan would tell you like this. Lord, I can't. Ugh, let's just keep going. Fine. Uh oh. Lucas, don't get on Amicia's, Amicia's uh, shit list there, Lucas. Yeah, he's going to go and rest. It would be a perfect... It'd be such a horrible, horrible thing if we accidentally, you know, went into his quarters and, oh man, we slipped a knife went into chest. Oh my goodness. What a horrible accident. Oh my God. <laughs> a curfew has been ordered by the Counts of all. All townsfolk, stay in your homes. A patrol. What's going on? The city's under lockdown. Anyone caught in the street will be arrested. There we are. They're locking down the whole city. Remember Damn. the locked district. They wouldn't dare purge a whole city. He ran into my knife. He ran into my yeah. knife five times. Five times! I tried to stop him after the fourth time. <laughs> just picture just someone standing there with a knife out and it's just like the person just keeps walking in. Oops, 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 oops. And the, the fourth time you're like, no, stop, please. And the fifth time, oops. Oh man, they're dead. what your control means yeah your control basically Look, means that watchtower at the back it leads to the harbor get ready men we'll move our load to the dock soon the wait dock where's is, the beast at that's where we're going isn't it those cages on their that's actually a quote from the musical slash movie chicago oh is it really i haven't seen that in forever i see i've seen the movie uh, Lucas is Amicia's, uh, not servant, uh, student. So, Alicia's, uh, Amicia's mother is a alchemist. 
and Lucas is basically her apprentice. So he's basically like her student. He's learning to be a, an alchemist and she's his teacher. Uh, but what if I want to kill these these soldiers? Oh my god, the music though. We, right. This the music in this is so good. Hey. Oh, Luca's here! Guys! The pupper boy is here. I haven't seen you in 18 years. Both the boys are here. Here, in case anybody hasn't met the pets. Quick pet break. Quick pet break. We got the best boy, Luca, and our pupper, Indy. Indy is the tan one, in case anybody hasn't met uh, Indy. He's our newest puppy. And then this boy is Luca, uh, and he's the elder brother. Look at these two boys. Hello. Hello, the boy. Yeah, they're both here. Luca boy. Hey, frog. Welcome on back. Uh, I got that song stuck in my head now. He had it coming. He had it coming. He only had himself to blame. Yeah, that's uh, whatever the asshole with the red hats. That's his. That's the song that we sing after we kill him. Assistant. Yeah, that's another way of saying it. Assistant. Apprentice. Uh, Luca Boy is here. Treat. Yeah, if anybody wants to buy any treats for the boys, we'll take a quick pupper break. We're going to be playing for a, a little bit longer. Uh, we only got about like 30-ish minutes, so we'll play a little bit longer. But we'll take a quick pupper break. So uh, if anybody wants to give either of these puppy boys... What, where is Indy? Oh, Hi. Hello! Oh my goodness! I'm being surrounded by these puppies. Good boy. Oh, a treat Take for treat Luca, time. boy. Thank you, Clock. Quick puppy treat break. Oh, are these his treats? Those are your cookies. Okay. Okay. All right. Let me give Luca a treat. Hang on a second. Hold on. Cause I'll do I'll do this with the camera. Hold on. Stop. All right. There we go. All right. Let me get Luca his treat. Hang on. It's tree time. Dad said paw. He's like, I gave paws. <laughs> I love the I love the gimbal camera. It's great. Uh, but thank you for the treat for Luca from Clock. Thank you for that clock. That tracking cam is so cool. Not to be a nerd. No, no, no. I love the gimbal cam. I love the gimbal cam. I was looking at a newer one that's like better quality because this one's not the best on quality. But uh the gimbal cams are really, really cool. Especially if you have like people in the room or you, you know, you're you're if yeah, it, it's just cool. I love it. <laughs> I really, really do love it. It's a it's a very, very cool thing. I'm glad you like it, Francis. Indy, please, sir, can I have some more? Thank you, Chris. Thank you for the treat for Indy boy. They're good puppies. They're really good. We have both of them tonight. Is that what's happening? Do we actually have both of them tonight? Do we have both? <laughs> they both just kind of looked over at Britt. They're like, yeah, do you have us tonight? You have the two bestest pup boys ever in the whole world. Oh my God. All right. All right. 
let's go ahead and get back to a little bit more of this uh we got uh, a little bit more left time left here in the stream uh so let's go ahead and jump on back into this so thank you quick puppy break i hope you enjoyed the puppy break i said that one day i'll get a cat i believe that you will though francis i believe that you will there's always plenty of pets out there that need a home you know where is ash you missed ash ash was actually in here earlier he was trying to get away from indy so he, uh story brought him in here and he was hanging out with us here uh, a little bit earlier Cool. That was weird. That was a little lag there. You asked me to ask Magister Vodan about the island. Vodan, fuck that the guy. Fisco in his lodge. What did he say? He said it's just a symbol. A, a two peak symbol, just as in Hugo's dream. I know. The island, the macula waking up, the order. It's too much. Glad to hear you say it. It helps me not to feel alone in this. You're not. I'm here. Oh, there we go. But yeah, he's uh, Ash is no longer in the room now. He went back upstairs. But he was here earlier for a brief, like, few minutes. I'm sorry, Amicia. For Hugo. He's not dead yet. All right. Remember, no more killing soldiers. No more killing us. I got it. No kills, no being spotted. Let's get this boat. I can't kill anybody. Am I not allowed to? Oh, I'm not allowed to. Okay. Um, let me see. Uh, I was sleeping. Will likely go back to sleep now that I have my PP time. No worries, Frog. It's all right. Um, but I hope that you have a good sleep and we're just going to be playing for another few minutes here and then we're going to probably be heading off after that. So good. I hope our pilot is too. Good point. I think it's that red cell. Oh, flower. Uh, I wish I could punch that the Dom guy. Same here. Absolutely same, Yuri. Also, hello. Oh my goodness gracious. Edge of the Freak coming in here with that beautiful, beautiful raid. Edge, thank you so much for that beautiful, beautiful raid. Thank you so much, Edge and crew, for that raid. How the heck are you doing, Edge? What's going on? demonic what is going on mike hello mike how are you doing sleazy thank you for the hype with the raid hype guys gals and pals please welcome on in edge and his crew edge is a, is a great great guy awesome streamer uh please go and drop him some love clock thank you for doing the shout out for edge edge how are you doing man how is everything going and how was uh how was your stream how was deep rock galactic i haven't had a chance to jump on and check out Deep Rock, uh, because I know that they just came out with uh, what is it? I think it's season season three, right? Season three is out and live now. Um, and I know I, I saw the trailer, I saw like what they added, but I wanted to check it out. I was actually supposed to check it out yesterday, but we got into uh, a spoopy game and then also a new Metroidvania game, and I was like totally like zooming in on it. I only did two games out of a 10, 11 hour stream yesterday. It was insane. Uh, Drifted also. Hi, Drifted. How are you doing? Uh, thank you, Clock. No problem, Edge. Season three is awesome. Nice, nice. Were you were you doing more with the Twitch integration? Sorry, I have two puppers right over here, and they're just like laying on top of me right now. Uh, but that's good to hear that season three is good. Yeah, I, I might try to check out some of it this upcoming Sunday. I, I'm gonna try to jump on and do some. Uh, but uh, thank you so much for choosing us to raid Edge, and uh, I hope that you had a good stream. Uh, integration was having a few issues, but we're working on it. Oh, okay. That's good. Yeah, there's probably some sort of update. I know that I saw that the mod manager had some sort of update. I haven't had a chance to like jump on and check it out, but um, uh, well, I'm, I'm just glad that you had a good time. I'm glad the stream was good. I'm glad you're enjoying season three. Uh, and quick introduction, just in case anybody doesn't know who I am. If you're new here, you came along with the raid. My name is Chris. I go by Chris, Chris X Chad, Crad, that beard guy, that bald guy. I am a variety streamer, and this here is called The Beard Zone, where we have a deep love and appreciation for beards. None are required. Um, and you are here on our single player slash interactive day. Monday is the day that we play single player story games or interactive stuff with Twitch integration and stuff like that. 
and uh, we are checking out A Plague Tale Requiem. It is the sequel to A Plague Tale Innocence. It's very, very good. I am really, really enjoying it. I loved the heck out of Plague Tale Innocence, and this one just takes it a step further with some new mechanics. The graphics are amazing. The story is really, really good so far. I am loving this so far. It's really, really good. Uh, good. Left to play with Edge and friends, and he bought, uh, brought me right back. <laughs> You're right back where you started tonight, Drifted, but I hope you had a fun time playing uh, playing some Deep Rock with Edge and, and the gang. Uh, also, a.k.a. Michael from Vsauce. Yeah, on a good day, Mike. On a good day, Michael from Vsauce. I'm the more handsome, handsomer version of Michael from Vsauce, let's be honest. <laughs> uh, but uh, yeah, welcome on in, everybody. I don't know if anybody has seen this game. Um, I'd like to offer him so much. It's uh, it's very, very good. And uh, it's also on Xbox Game Pass if anybody is interested in this. Uh, yeah, yeah, you know it. Uh, this game, this game is fucking fantastic. Watch a couple people play it all the way through and it's so good. I know, I am having a blast with it. Uh, we just had, I don't know if you've, like how much of it you've watched, but the part that just happened was like starting to get to me. Uh, um, Amisha just like had a, a rage breakdown and just killed a bunch of dudes um and now we are trying to self stealthily get to that boat over there and um get them to, to head on into the port over here uh but hi kitty how are you doing welcome on in uh but yeah this game is very very good i do recommend definitely check out the first one because the first one came out in 2018 um all right. Come on! Should be at the gates already. Here they are. Keep moving. Quiet. Get off my back. We can't afford to break these jars. The city's running out of time. The be right back. All right, Mike. Sounds good. I'm doing okay. Been here since the start, which is lurking because playing Ark. Totally understandable. Totally understand. Monday is usually our like chill, chill hangout days, so people aren't super active, and I totally get. It. I don't expect anybody to be super chatty and everything, so. Uh, but otherwise, I'm good. I'm good. Um, I have a really, really big thing that is going on tomorrow. I can't talk about it because uh, it, it's not set in stone, but there might be a big, big, big announcement. Like I'm talking about like one of my dream things might be happening tomorrow. So a uh, big announcement possibly tomorrow on stream. Uh, we did announce uh, we were, you know, we had a great stream so far. We had a nice just chatting session. And we did announce earlier, we're actually going to be revitalizing slash moving our merch shop over, um, which was another big thing I want to announce. Uh, we got invited to a new merch organization called Fourth Wall. They actually invited us to be a part of their program. And they have so many cool things and stuff. Uh, so uh, we're re revitalizing the Beard Zone merch shop, new logos, designs, and stuff like that, even like seasonal stuff and everything. So really, really excited to start working on that. And... Um, all I ask is that even if you don't know me or anything, just keep your fingers crossed because this thing that might happen tomorrow might be something huge. And it's like kind of like a dream for me. So uh, got a meeting tomorrow and then possibly big announcement tomorrow. So really excited. But otherwise, I'm doing fantastic, Kitty. Thank you for asking. And I hope everybody is having a great, great Monday. I know hey, it's it's day. been weird. It's Let's been it's been a weird it's been a chat. weird day, but a good Monday, you know. Uh, thank you, Kitty. Yes. Hype. Hype it up, please. It's it's. I can't even believe that it's happening. If it actually does happen, so we'll see. It's going to be terrible. A real rat's carnival. A real rat's carnival. Okay, that was that was good. All right, open the gate. All right. Uh, but yeah, I'm doing good. I'm doing. I'm just really enthralled also with this game. This game is so good. Yeah, I'm wondering. I'm like, they're they're. What are they doing? Uh. Door, no door. Uh, but thank you for asking, Kitty. I hope that you are doing well, and I hope everybody is doing well. I'm sorry if I'm repeating myself, but I just know how tough Mondays can be. So make sure everybody's having a good time here hanging out with us and thank you everybody for being here and hanging out with us tonight let's see that gate uh 
Oh, now I can use my sling. That's great. All right. Well, you know, I can't even kill these guys because they both are wearing helmets. So. Ooh, box. Stuff. Okay, Chris, I'm back. Just watched a bit of Freckle stream. If he, if Freckle's still streaming by the time that we get on, we'll probably end up going and reading him. Edge, I'm not even kidding you. I don't know if you're still here or not, or if you had to walk away or anything, but I, I had you on my list of potential lurks. Or, well, lurks slash also potential raids. I, I, this is like usually around the time where I start like scouting ahead, uh, for the night and everything. Make it this time. I believe nothing. Let's make some of that. Keep coming from the city, and we had too many of our own. I should have gone to see my mother when I could. Uh, how's Freckled Stream going? And uh, yeah, we'll probably end up going now. Uh, going to raid Freckled Stream here in a little bit. Yeah, I'm just a fart in the wind. You don't see nothing. I'm like John Cena. Yeah, I'm surprised, honestly, Freckles streaming so late. I'm actually really, really hyped for him because normally at this time, he probably would be really, really tired. So kudos to him for, you know, for doing it. Wait until that guy is out of range and bada bing. What's making that noise? Oh yeah, also, I'm all caught up with Hell of a Boss, by the way. I'm all caught up with Hell of a Boss. So far, season two of Hell of a Boss is very, very good. It looks like a battlefield. What happened here? I don't know, but let's follow that god and keep Yeah, <laughs> Dylan, I didn't even know that you were still here, but I even said to myself in my brain, I'm like, if Dylan heard that, he probably would say something about it. But yeah, I realized I only watched a few episodes of season one of Hell of a Boss. So I I caught up on it and watched the rats. Holy shit. Had liquid on the ground. It's from their jaws. It smells like tar. If it is, it, it's highly flammable. Try setting it on fire. Yes, yes. Let's try. I didn't expect that. Neither did they. Careful with those flames. Holy shit. That is an insane amount of mice or rats. It can be pushed. Yes. This is all wrong. Let's hope Marseille is different. Wait until the rats invade it. Amicia, the order will have special buildings in Marseille. Equipment and people. People like Voda. How do you think this will end? <sighs> Staying here is dying anyway. Fuck Voda. Baden, whatever his name is. He is a total, total asshole. Getting closer. But anyway, I don't know if anybody has seen the first uh, game. Um, for this, this is the sequel. Things always seem to be so quiet in the dark. Let's not those here. not those rats though. Those rats be loud. They be real real loud. 
That was a wall of rats. Oh. What a mess. Whoa, that smell. Tar. Makes your head spin. I don't hear any locked from the inside. Okay, we gotta be careful. Lord, what is all this? A tar workshop. They must use it to seal boat hulls. These mechanisms are still intact. It smells different here. Resin. This is a mixing pool. That barrel up there must be the diluent. We should move on. Oh, rats. Don't panic. We have resin. It just needs that diluent up there, and we get tar. Well spotted. So we're making tar now. I know, but it shouldn't take us long. Well, let's get to it. I gotta go back this way. Good. Unless you're at a so rave, I mean, one. that's that's pretty much true. <laughs> yes, you're not wrong. I'll move the platform closer. On my way. All right, we can make a bunch of stuff. see what we got to do here I see it's alcohol of course are we ready yes let's make that tar pouring do you know the quantities no I'm improvising please don't kill us good I think you can light it up all right let's see what our tars were no. oh, it's working yes Well, that's one step. What now? I'm stuck. Wait. I think they experimented with some ingredients here. And yes, that could work. I'll throw them to you. Those beasts are oh really close. Yeah, these guys are uh Here. Say when you're ready to catch. Go. I can now craft tar. Hey. Throw a pot of tar between those two big basins. Here we go. Oh, tar in a pot. We want tar in a pot. Tar? Let's see what our tars were. Aha. That last pool there is already full of tar. Coming. A lot of mice, a lot of rats. You saved my skin. The tar did. This stuff works miracles. The tar, the magical tar, ta ta. Cool. So we got a new craftable thing. That's pretty cool. We now know how to craft the ta 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 ta. should be straight ahead right don't be too sure about that listen amicia about hugo i was stuck between magister vodan and your mother and i have no excuse I trying to backpedal it's just he realizes prepared. he done fucked up he realizes he done thing. fucked up i can't we'll do what's right we will but anyway I saw in a screen though that it said the word bolts. So I want to know what that is because we have not gotten bolts yet. I have a sneaky suspicion what that might be. 